and there's going to be a new exhibit my lord is just still waiting for a copy of that exhibit will be a notice of rights which which will be exhibit ll1 we haven't received a copy as yet my lord okay And my lord, just to orientate the court on the exhibit, exhibit MM, as we mentioned, uh, I'm sorry, NN. Mm -hmm. Consists of uh, several pages, my lord. Yeah. It goes up to page uh, 16. If some of the pages are not legible we will correct that then exhibit <coughs> mm consists of nine pages We have tried to bind the uh, the exhibits, my lord, mm. but I see that exhibit MM and NN are right in the was the end of the bundle that has been provided to the court. And
Are you ready? Yes, uh, my lord, just once again, we just want to mention that exhibit M Yeah, as for certain pages that might not be visible. <coughs> and that exhibit in fact goes up to page eleven, my lord. And not nine. Page Okay, page eleven. Yes, up to page eleven. And it goes along with exhibits UU1 and 2. Then exhibit NN. Goes up to page 18. However, pages 17 and 18 already form part of Exhibit KK, which has already been handed up. And all these are OB entries, model from various police stations. Yeah, okay. Uh, if we can also ask that my colleague advocate Sibanda be allowed to assist the, should the need arise, to assist the witness with the exhibits. You wanted to say something, Mr. Minister? Yes, sir. Mm. Um, just an indulgence, just to address the court on one aspect. You want to? I'm requesting for an indulgence just to address the court on one aspect relating to this witness. <coughs> okay. Yes. <coughs> My well, Lord, it will be remembered that uh, at the onset, of the, uh, at the inception of the trial within a trial, the state made mention of the, vec or, I mean, of the fact that um, there are statements that the state would want to prove um, in respect of accused number three, four, and five. Um, the <coughs> there was a bit of a of a, of, a, of a request for clarification there as to what is it that the state would want to demonstrate to the court on the content of the said statement that the state says it wants to prove against accused number one, uh, I mean number three, four, five. Then the state said, it is just the statement, my lord. Now, um, on the documents that we have been furnished by the state, which are the statement regarding the interview with the suspect, which is the document that the state intends to prove against accused number three, four, and five, we have noted, my lord, that uh, there's a portion where this witness also participated in that document. To be very specific, he participated as a commissioner of oath. Now, before the court could um, resume, we took this aspect up with our colleague for the state advocate Baloy and wanted to clarify with him as to whether or not would then that be the beginning of a testimony on the aspect of admissibility of the document that we mentioned at the beginning 
of the trial within the trial as they relate to accused number three, four, and five. The answer that we're getting, my lord, is that this witness will not be testifying um, about accused number three, about accused number four, and about accused number five. But the challenge that we have, my lord, is his name is included in the statement that we were furnished. You know, on the on the on the on the statement regarding the interview with the suspect, his name is also included there. So I'm I'm not so sure whether the state intends to because the state specifically indicated that this witness will only testify in respect of accused number one and two. I'm not so sure whether the state is then saying that. This witness for purposes of this trial within the trial as it is happening now will only uh, concentrate on accused number one and two and again within the same trial within the trial this witness is going to be recalled to come and say something if there is anything to be said in respect of accused number three four and five my lord. that is the clarification that we want to know and the basis of this clarification, my lord, it's simply that if this witness were to say, were to, were to start to say something about accused number three, four, and, and I'm not pleading the case here of accused number four and five as well, my lord, but we are in the same boat here. Um, but if this witness were to, were to start as he is being led by the state to say something in relation to accused number three, well, comma, four, and accused number five, then we'll go back to the initial argument that we raised at the beginning, my lord, that before a witness does to, to testify against accused number three, four, and five, we would want to know exactly with certainty as to what is it that the state intends to demonstrate when it uh, bleeds the evidence relating to the to the warning statements in other words what is it that the state would ultimately want to argue as being the content of the statement that it wants to prove before court my lord that is going to enable us to prepare our defense and conduct our defense in line with what the state is going to argue ultimately as to why it actually wants to lead to this, uh, this, uh, this, uh, this information or evidence, my lord. Thank you, my lord. Yes, Mr. Baloui. As you could please, my lord, um, I have indeed intimated to my colleagues that this witness will be confined to the <laughs> statements um, that were made by accused number one and two. Um, hence, we've been going through the occurrence book entries, and those pertain only to accused one and two. In so far as the issue is concerned that has been raised by Advocate uh, Nisi, that this witness um, might have commissioned the warning statement of their clients. Well, Firstly, um, his evidence is not going to touch on that. Uh, I've given them that, that assurance. But secondly, um, my understanding of their defense during the trial within the trial is that their clients did not make any statements. So um, the commissioning thereof, uh, with the greatest of respect, you know, I don't think is is an issue. They're simply saying, you know, they, they didn't make any 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 statement. So um, it's then um, for the state then to show that indeed um, a statement was was made. And we must keep in mind at this stage, my lord, that it's only about the uh, voluntariness of the statement and not the contents thereof. So, uh, advocate uh, Sergeant Mohanes evidence should we reach that point about the contents will only be relevant at this stage if those state the contents of those statements are disputed but for present purposes my lord um we, we're not going to canvas that so these are the statements of accused three four five yes because the defense of accused 
number three, four, five, is that they are clients did not make any yes. statements. Indeed. But in the same breath, they want to know what is the contents of the statements. Yes. Is that what? Yes, well, um, <laughs> it's an oxymoron. It's a, a two-pronged... Uh, you know what's uh, an oxymoron? A two-pronged uh, um, attack on the warning statements, but uh, we are of the view, my lot, that that shouldn't really uh, be an issue at, uh, at at this stage, given their their defence. Mr. Mlisi, what's your response? Because Mr. Baloi says your defence. Yes, my lord. Is that your clients two, yes. three, four, five never yes. made statements? Yes, my lord. Never made statements. Yes, my lord. Yeah. That is so, my lord. However, so, that needs to be contextualized. When we say they did not make any statement, um, I'm not even so sure whether I'm positioned now to to disclose what actually happened. But I think ultimately it will have to come to the court, my lord. When I said that it did not make any statement, it does not mean that there's something that is not contained in this document, my lord. There is something that is contained in this document which it does not bear knowledge of. So on the on the basis of what is contained in the statement, prima facie, there's a statement that was made, but our defense is it did not make that statement. That is what I meant by saying it did not make a statement, my lord. He bear no knowledge of what is contained in here. Yes, and the state you. insists, my lord, that um, they would want to prove the statement. And I don't think that the state would simply want to prove the statement or the document simply for the sake of it being a document. There is something that is contained in this document that the state would want to demonstrate and bring it to the attention of is this court. Is there any court. unlawfulness in that aspect? Because this court, if anything is unlawful yes, and doesn't comply with the constitution, I won't allow it. As it but I, cannot, I, can't, I don't know what you, are, you, 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 you guys are talking about. I don't know. All I know is what the state is telling me, that uh, they have a witness who's not going to traverse yes, the evidence of number three, four, yes. five. He's going to testify in respect of the evidence of one and two. Yes, my lord. And then Mr. Baloy says, you, as far as he's concerned, your clients, you have, you have told him, did not make any statements. But he is saying your clients made statements. That's it. So that, that, that matter be resolved by the evidence. I told you about officers of court to tell this court one thing and the other thing. I mean, what should I do? He says your clients made statements. You say your clients didn't make statements. How will I know? I don't have them here. Let the evidence be led. If those statements are inadmissible, we'll see. If they are admissible, we'll see. I don't know. I can't prejudge the issue here now. Okay. Uh, that is the reason why, my lord, we, I am standing and saying that mm. in the document where the state alleges that our client made a statement, mm. the name of these witnesses, of these witness features, but the state then says, no, don't worry, this witness will not, not say anything about your client. So we don't know whether we need to cross-examine this witness or what. Any witness who testifies here, you have a right to cross-examine him or her. Okay. As it is the court. Yes, Mr. Baloui, let's start. <coughs> As the court, please, my lord. Can you say, you have saw the witness in? Not yet. Not lord. yet. Please do so. May it please the court. Ngala Ushama Kamako Wonke Nesbo. Ascandida. Ukulu Uso Kuluma Lukuli. Spade. Utravalora Spade. Kupa Wule Lemma Ina Akamoka Le Sefan. Yena Vus Umozi Mohani. Utravalebo Tata Aka Uji Atlamo Yago Bolela Nedi. No objection to taking the prescribed oath, my lord. Rano re tabulala nete ne nete fela usansu singan kan nete. Emesa di sawa re mudima utush. Mudima utush. So swan, my lord. Yes. Is it correct that you are a surgeon 
in the South African police? Can I talk to you about the South African South Africa? That is correct. Most of all, oh, you can't say that you have to say that South Africa is here. When did you join the South African police service? What do you mean by the police service in South Africa? August 2002, Guardian 4. On the 4th of August 2002. Can you just briefly set out your career history with uh, the police until now? I was a police officer in the city of Kaiwa and Kaiwa and I was a police officer in the city of Kaiwa. I was a police officer in the city of Kaiwa in 2002, Kaiwa College. I joined the uh, police service in 2002 and I went to college. I was in 2002 and I went to college. I went to the college and I went to the basic training and I went to the station and I went to the focus. I then finished my basic training and I went back to the station and I became a detective. I went to the college and I went to college and I went to college. Which station? Station is it? Miguel Uvel Police Station. I was in the Uvel Police Station. I was in the Uvel Police Station. In Johannesburg. Yeah, in Johannesburg. Yes, it's in Johannesburg. Yes. Yeah, books are good. We were traveling from 2004, Bangisha Hillboro Tracing Unit. From there, in 2004, I was taken to the Hillbrook Tracing Unit. So, I was taken to the Hillbrook Tracing Unit. I was taken to the Hillbrook Tracing Unit. And then from there, I went back to Yeovil and uh, as a detective. Uh, so, I was taken to the Yeovil and I was taken to the Yeovil and I was taken to the Yeovil. Yes, which years? Uh, the early 2006. It was in 2006. Yes. Then 2007, I joined the Johannesburg Vehicle Theft Unit. In 2007, I joined the Johannesburg Vehicle Theft Unit. In 2007, I was in the early to the Johannesburg Vehicle Theft Unit. In 2010, Kajuna Provincial Taxi Violence Unit, Kumukopaningli, Kenel Ginin, there was still a captain there, Brigadier. In 2010, 2010, Provincial Taxi Violence Unit. I joined the Provincial Taxi Violence Unit, which uh, where I met uh, Brigadier Dininza. At the time, he was still a captain. Is it correct that Brigadier Gininda is the lead investigator in this matter? That is correct. We are now going to show you how to do that. Yes. Omega 2012 for Kawala, Johannesburg Vehicle Theft Unit. In 2012, I went back to the Johannesburg Johannesburg Vehicle Theft Unit. Johannesburg Vehicle Theft Unit. In 2012, I went back to the Johannesburg Vehicle Theft Unit. Yes. Then 2016, I joined the National Cold Case Unit in Pretoria. In 2016, I joined the National Cold Case Unit in Pretoria. In 2016, I joined the National Cold Case Unit in Pretoria. And who is the head of that unit? Kikiman Omogolomo. The Brigadier Gininda. It is Brigadier Gininda. Yes. Ome, below join a unit here. Mshumo waka. Kiro collect a di pocket. Kiro tora. Tina ringcha frigaboraka munga. 
And in my duties within this unit is to collect dockets uh, from all over South Africa. Uh, these dockets are those that uh, have cases that uh, uh, we are concerned with. Yes. No. No. In total, how many years service do you have? Uh, in the South African police service. I have 21 years in the South African police service. In the South Africa. Are you part of the investigating team in this matter? That is correct. And what do your duties entail in this team? More team Which is to be a detective. And also to investigate the uh, suspects. the exhibit for downloading. And also to take, get to collect the exhibits to take them for downloading. Uh, also, the very important uh, responsibility is to arrest once we have finished with our investigations. Can you then tell the court in your own words what happened in December of 2019? Uh, December 2019. Uh, uh, Brigadier Kininda got information about the case of uh, the death of Senzo Meiwa, but at that time he was still ready. He was a colonel at, at that time. Brigadier Kininda also like was my lana no kubula ga Senzo Meiwa. Got a little cutie. Why so colonel? Yes. And since we're working together, he, we, 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 he brought us together and we sat down and discussed this particular case. And Boba is a seven and the one year was business as a la pansy, say, pega pega, little daddy. Yes. We know each other, or only. Yes. yes, you don't need to go into oh. details. What, what did you do in December of 2019? Oh, who did I in December 2019? And while we're conducting our investigations, a name of. Uh, come on. The name of Bongani Ntanzi came up. Yes, and there was a, an informer who told us that this man is involved in this case. Yes, Information was received regarding 
Uh, Mr. Bongan in Taz, is that correct? What did you do as a result of that information? We sat down and discussed it and they wanted to know where he could be found and where and what he had done. So I said, Tala Pansi said, Go Kalinda Masa, Funa Ubaz, Uti, Wednesday, and Futino Uti, Utolagala. Yes. We are going to look at where mining was in Western area. Well, it was then discovered that he worked for a certain mine in Western area. So I just told you, two sons are going to mine in the Western area. Yes. We tried to look for him, unfortunately, we could not find him. Some phone out to us, some see who was in town. Yes. We are trying to look for Shulia Renarno, Oshia Tuti Lewile. Yes, you received information. Yes. Did you follow up on the information? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, we did follow up on that information. Yes, and what did you establish? Yes. Yes, you followed up the information. Yes. What did you find? We discovered that he is indeed involved in that case. Did so I told you that he was a pair of wheels. Did you try to trace him? Did you try to trace him? Yes, we did look for him. He was a man. Yes. Did you try to trace him? Did you try to trace him? Yes. Did you try to trace him? Yes. Did you try to trace him? Yes. And as we were looking for him, we also discovered that there are certain cases which he might be uh, uh, be involved in apart from this specific one. So I told you to go and meet me. I'm going to meet you. 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 And then we went to look for those uh, cases and we found them. So I said, I'm going to go to the house. Yes. And we went to sit again and uh, to discuss with Brigadier Keninda. I said, I'm going to go to the house. Brigadier Keninda. And also we work with Sergeant Mukula. Footing the servants are no Sergeant Mukula. Yes. How are you going to be able to do it in December? I'm going to be able to do it in December. And from December we looked uh, for him and we, uh, we looked all over for him. And so I'm going to say my son, four now, what I say, four now, get down. Yes, which year? Long ago, then. Late 2019 and early 2020. And so I'm going to say, 2019, go for 2020. Yes. Oh, my dear, my dear, my dear, my dear, my dear, sorry, oh. We look for him until we discovered that he stays in Pukeng in Rustenburg. So I'm from the south at all. I'm going to Utushala, a Pukeng, a Rustenburg. Yes. When did you locate him? In the la 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 Mukwejani. On the morning of June. We we eventually got him in June. Officially. Oh, how many? Twenty twenty. In twenty twenty. So I'm going to assume that in June twenty twenty. Yes. O megar o anal matam milade mincha megam ko yona. Rare fitha ko ola lo mogolo ko rimnya kala wana wanungo ma. Wana lo mogolo? Wanungke kisa nungo ma. Oh, 
Mula. Yeah. Oh, well, since he had many cases, there was a big case uh, that was from Nongoma that he appeared to be involved in as well. Stairs, my son, Funas, a turn over to Kona, and the fellow Nongoma, Nalo Archidega. Yes. Then Wabale went up a Air Force Lora Silona. There was also another case from Force Loras. It was over Nelly Carlos Force Loras. Uh, is single up law where um, 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 uh, not is a uh, murder case. Ungelona is a little look, Bula. Yes, Ome era dealing with the Viganali Sergeant Mabena, the late Sergeant Mabena. I also mentioned that I was with Sergeant Mabena, the late Sergeant Mabena. Uh, I think she was with you, I think the son of Sergeant Mabena also says she. And who is Sergeant Mabena? Come on, Sergeant Mabena. Uh, Sergeant Mabena, he overall for like crime intelligence. Most at uh, most police Africa war. Uh, Sergeant Mabena used to work in the in crime intelligence in the South African police. So Sergeant Mabena, go ahead and say, "Nala, Baba Funage, Baba Chungata, Uluazi is is police in South Africa." When did he pass on? Was Ula Shaba Fanani? Ever go pull up with the Mwara of the. September. If I remember correctly, he passed away in, in the last year in September. Monk Mulla said, Was with him Sabini, Gulu in your way to Ule on September. Kabunzia Motor. In a car accident. Ugua Shonag and goes in your mount. Yes. O message ma bena ke na ba ru o ba ya ru go ba peletsa information. Sergeant ma bena was the one that was collecting information for us. Sergeant ma bena o ena was ko kala u dwas. Yes. And ke na ga pe ba lo ro ba shumala le tlo di tsedi ntse tsere di 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 thushitseng ma ratu. He was also the one who was working together with the other informants that were uh, helping us in this case. We na wa insurance age na ba nye ke aba se tsonga tsela u dwas ke le di lo luta. Yes, you mentioned that you were with uh, him, Sergeant Mabena. What, what happened? Who did I join? Urle, the Bornali, and Sergeant Mabena. Yeah, on the 16th of June, we arrived in Pukeng. On the 16th of June, we did arrive in Pukeng. On the 16th of June, South Africa, Pukeng. Which year? 2020. That was in 2020. Yes. Kare show di bese chiri budi chowre. Ram kara kai bongan intansi ra kume eloro boincha plekeo. Since the informant informed us where we would find bongan intansi, he then directed us to that place. Yes, we followed up the information. What happened? And then how was it done? So at the time I learned that the level di cha malato aroincha intansi dulango ana kume ramona ilo masagari. We went there during the day, and where we were, he showed us where uh, Ntanzi could be found. What's the status of Salah? Ntanzi Chora of Konago is a meet. Yes. Hello, Manjibwana. On June 16, 2020, the area police station near Pugeng. On the evening of June 2016, we went to the Pugeng police station. We see that we are the 16th of June 2020. This is the first time we went to the Pugeng. Yes. Can we talk about the first time? The police station is not only the police station, but the police station is also the police station. It is the custom that when I go to a different place, we need to go first to the local police station and ask for assistance. Who am I talking about? I am saying we are in doubt. So, if you are saying that the police station is not the police station, it is the police station. Yes. 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 National Cold Case Investigation are the same place where we are going to go. We will are the same more too. And then we inform them that we come from the National Cold Case Unit, and we do not know the place, and we do not trust anyone. So this is what I learned. So I said, "Sir, what is the Pumago National Cold Case Unit? Sir, what is it? Has it been down for the September month?" Yes. Okay. We may be able to do more. We are going to be able to do more. We are going to be able to do more. We are going to be able to do more. We are going to be able to do more. We are going to be able to do more. We are going to be able to do more. We are going to be able to do more. We are going to be able to do more. We are going to
Montans and Dulanga, she's a woman. Uh, they also agreed to accompany us to where we in dance were staying, where the place that we had been shown during the day. I said, for my good pass, Pedas, I see a glenda, loud as I told her a corner, I get a super scumbus, I mean, yes. Yes. Ome love it up. Rapoko tamo rumi eri banim saka rian tanzi. On arrival, we knocked at the room which had been which had seen during the day where tanzi is supposed to stay. So as far as I know, so I will leave the room. Kumbilele asa chele ugutu tanzi tala kona enskunti siwe emini. Instead, this was in Puke. Yes, in Puke. Rustenberg. Yeah, how we say Puke in Rustenberg. Yes. Um, we are really much of the police are And we informed them that we are the police and that they opened for us. Uh, some chalut is on a police also bule. Yes. Um, we are on which channel are we going to go? And when we got inside, we found him with his Tswana girlfriend. So says Tora Konoge, Uguti Wesha Nungwa Yake Yum Tswana. Yes. Ile kamuja kara wano kalabe. Apo wa mera, malatu mwa lungo, mamu babula ili mu tibile li tunya suwe chariki. And we informed him that he is uh, a suspect in the case of murder yes. in Nongoma, where also a gun was found. So, since I got to, I think they are going to tell Nongoma that we are going to move to put in a good team. This bomb says I told a guy. Our valley very general need to work in a garage for their name. We are going to change it. Since we were already uh, aware that it was him, since uh, our informer had. Uh, had given us information about him. John Bassas is a good way and I'm over. Oh, I see the old ones. Why is this jelly? Oh, yeah. Yes. Hello, I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. And I asked him what he knows about the Nongoma case. I said, I'm going to go to the Nongoma case. Yes, you interviewed the suspect. Was he then arrested? Yes. Yes, we arrested him. Yes, we arrested him. Yes. We have to go to the Nongoma case. Yes. We have to go to and then uh, in, informed him of his uh, rights. And I said, I'm telling him, I don't get the act. I'm telling him, handcuffs. And then we handcuffed him. So, I said, I'm telling Yes. Which, which, which are those rights that, that you explained to him? Uh, how, how did you go about explaining those rights? We first told him that we are arresting him regarding the Nongoma case. Um, so, I said, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, Ome ona li tukela uhumula askavulela. First, told him that he has the right to remain silent. The same child who tuna lunge lo lo utula. Yes. Lugo le sa atlos bale la ngasa sa shumishiwa katanungle na le chichere tibo. And also that whatever he says could be used against him in a, in a court of law. When you go to the Oma Guti Kona Agu Agu Shaw, you can say Jensi so a Kulinita la la in Gandol. Lower Agahumana, Mimidi, Ea, 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 we also told him that uh, he has the right to uh, legal representation and if he is unable to afford uh, legal representation, then he, he has the right 
to be given a legal representative, a lawyer that uh, is going to be paid for by the state. So I said, I'm trying to go to Lunga, the Rogutabe, no mail, got a gama, but I was a cocker on mail, a umbosom, a nigger on mail, also says on a cocker. Yes, um, Salam, Chia, Ramana Major, Governor, Elena Pretoria North. When we uh, placed him in our car and then we took him to Pretoria North, so Susan Faga gave Motini to sign a Pretoria North. Did you merely explain his rights verbally? Eh, jale lile la mucha di tu kelo chao kamulo mofela. Eh, kamuli chamulo mofela tu kelo kwenye ono kwa lupuke. Yes, when we were in Puke, I only told him his rights verbally. We should say Puke in Gram Chela and Umlo, I'm a Lungelo. Yes, and more or less, what time was it when you arrested him? Yale, Limusere in Nakuma. Yale, nine, nine, I'm sure. It was nine in the evening. Koko, nine was up soon. Yes. Omer as well and Rafi Fale and up Pretoria North Police Station. And then we went with him to the Pretoria North Police Station. So somebody said, so figure Pretoria North Police Station. Rafi Fale and a Kabo Matena, so probably get to ten or past ten, Maranilla around ten. Uh, we arrived at around 10, I'm not sure whether it was uh, before 10 o'clock or just after 10 o'clock, but it was around that time. So I said, I'm going to show you how to show you. I'm going to show you how to show you. I'm going to show you how to show you. Yes, yes. 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 And then when he arrived, I then handed him over the, uh, his rights, uh, uh, his written rights. I said, we must figure out how to do it. I said, we have to figure out how to do it. Yes, but please, Malat, we have not yet received this notice of rights. As soon as we receive it, it will be handed as Exhibit LN1. SAP 49. LN1. Okay, I'm sorry, Malat. 49. SAP 49. Yes. SAP 14A, my lord. Yeah, okay. Yes. Omega Lega Malala Chona Ape. I also proceeded to read the rights for him again. I said, Mfundela, Wana Gamadunga, I can food. We do much of another Sisulu, Le Sesoto, Les Hoa, and then I used the three languages Zulu, English, and Sesoto. Uh, the aim of which was to ensure that he understands. I say, in fact, in which I get some Zulu, now get some Lungu, now get some Sotho. Get the Lungu tige. Give me a sense of so good to use the silly and bad. Oh, we like we see that and say that you are not the. He then showed that he understands and he proceeded to sign uh, the document. I welcome the Sotho two years. Putige was a Kubegage. We are signed that up. Yes. Omerila Ramutwalela on a move for sure go away. We then locked him up on that night. Sassim Valela Globo Sugu, Corner Lapo. And what is the procedure when someone is placed in the cells? When you go into the police station, there is a book called an OP book. You can read it. You can read it. You can read it. You can read it. You book. Yes. What does OP stand for? Just for the purpose. OP A M G. Occurrence book. It is it's OB stands for occurrence book. Major oh, yeah. OB Melo Gutige or Ila Palacona is in Desen Zerai, is it because nothing is the occurrence book? Home a Vaila Mongala Gamora because very Fisa, Ovali Purusali, Luchinga, what is selling a little one 
Where well, is the Well, he was the his name was then entered into the occurrence book because there is this policeman whose duty is to uh, uh, record people who are taken in and people who are taken out. I just want to show you exhibit MM, page one, there of the exhibit MM. And I Can you just identify what is that exhibit? MM? Okay, I'm gonna go to Charles Jobe in exhibit MM. Key in. Key entry. Come on, all over and we change what we do. It is gentle and simple. In this page, we can see uh, where it was recorded that we had brought Mr. Ndanzi to that facility. Lapa le go palwe la ukuthi sa letter uba kuNdanzi sim letter kuleyo ndawo. Can you place and record the details regarding the day of the week and the date? Is it is go palwe le re malelo re ebe le tshatse le 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 fing la beke le gore e le tshatse la bona ebe le date e fing. Is a peer on top of the document? Ka mo go e bona ga lang go godimo ga le kwa. It was on a Tuesday in 2020. In 2020? June 16th. On the 16th of June. And what is the relevant entry as well as the time? Uh, serial number is 467. There is a serial number that starts with 467. Then now go hearing 2242. There's a time also which is 2242. The entry in which in transit or in transit. Uh, also, there's an entry that says in transit. Yes, in, can you? In transit, era or as much as there is the chance as a support station here. Uh, in transit. Uh, is meant to indicate that uh, the person that is being brought there is not intended to be kept at that specific police station. We should take a matter of in transit. Because we should look into why not? Yeah, why not? Let us have put a yoke in our corner. Why is it so Yes. Can you place the particulars there of on record? Yes. Um, Detective Sergeant Mohani of National Court Case Unit. And who's that? Kimani, no. Detective Sergeant Mohani. Uh, Detective Sergeant Mohani. It is written here, Detective Sergeant Mohani. Court Case Unit with one suspect. We should go to the Opumaga called case unit to Hamburg and I'm sorry, oh, yeah, to the Mitchell or case number non goma 160 of 10 2018. With the non goma case number 163 of 10 2018. 163 of 10 2018. Le Malungue, Lalaga, Adi, Tukidu, Tokoja, Oswara. Rijiza SAPC SAP 14A gas kwa. Also the right his legal rights the SAP 14. Ome ina leno. Just read it as it is. As it is. No, it's not. Okay. SAP 14 512 double six seven six five. Time of arrest twenty one hundred. With no injuries. Contact number of Sergeant Mohani. Yes, you don't need to read that. Yes. If I lamo, and then more fast more, when all detain correct low mega sign.
Well, underneath, uh, it is also written, uh, detained correctly, and then I signed. We don't tell up again, oh, we are Palo again, meaning one of which is a woman, ITSAP, SAP fourteen, now one get over Palo, no goody, Agali Malanga, or Cora Farnes Cat, so goody, who Boshwenin will find a goody, who he number the Zalumudum Leti Lega or Sergeant Morale, Ganja, and was a target over the way in Gogum Ted. Just for record purposes, uh, can you just explain what is that SAP fourteen A? SAP 14 SAP 14 is a book where which in which all uh, the arrested people are recorded in. SAP 14 a SAP 14A, um, the number that starts with 512. Double six seven six five. What is it? we are the SAP fourteen A. E number A number five one two double six seven six five. Key key key. The tokelo chairman file out your na. Chief of the case. We are the we are the one who is 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 of the uh, legal rights where they are recorded. Each time a person is given this legal rights, there is a number that is attached to to that, a unique number. Also, this is a book with many pages. Uh, and the footy get up or get get out of footy and the city number which the Is there the one that you mentioned that you explain it to him in Sesotho, is Zulu in English? That is correct. Yes, what happened after that? Well, we placed him inside and then he was locked up and they uh, received him and we left him there. We have some fire and a party, Bamam Gela, Bam Fadela, Sassimus Shala. Yes. Um, I get Brigadier North Police Station. And after that, I phoned Brigadier Ginza to inform him that we had found in Tanzi and that we had locked him up in the in Pretoria uh, Police Station. Brigadier, Brigadier. Kininda. And the footage is saying invalid a Pretoria police station. You may brigade your own or the Sarim Mona Sasa, a Chachela Telao. Then the brigade uh, 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 said, I'm going to see him tomorrow, implying the following day. I was Sorry, just to go, go back to the entry, did you place the time on record? Uh, yes, the time was 22.42. We have a scratch of 22.42. Yes. Well, we left him there until the morning of the following day. Some issue I for who's a good for a sin. Eh, and the lie on the evening of the seventeenth. He let go of Alma Bena, Ravella, Pretoria North. Mabena and I went back to Pretoria North. Just place a year on record, 17 uh, June of which 17 June, uh, 
6, 2020. No, no, sorry, 17 June 2020. Sorry. Uh, that was the 17th of June 2020. Uh, which, um, sorry, 17 June 2020. Yeah, no, no, what happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? What Yes. Robert Vita, Rahopela and Tanzir Pala Mona. And then our rival there we requested to see in Danzi. Must be a Pasaka Lubon and Danz. Ome Rilera Munchagua is selling Ramisha Potru. We took him out of the cell and we took him to the boardroom. Sir, since I'm keeper, Marcelli and Samisa Potroom. And what is the procedure when someone is taken out of the cells like you have done? The person that is in charge of the cells is going to make an entry into the OB book. Oh, seven, I must tell you, so far, I will enter into the OB book. And who was such an entry made? And uh, in Willa Angwala. Yeah. That is correct. Yeah, we Well, it's page three of uh, Exhibit MM. Can you read the relevant details? Build the week and the date. Re kupa ore mwale mo kupa diluen oboru Willa inshiwa we uno ibala kamoka. Uh, at, at, at the top there, the date. Oh, the date. Yeah, yeah, the date. Yeah, yeah. 2020. It is the 17th of the sixth month of 2020, and it was a Wednesday. to okay. Yes, in the relevant entry. Uh, when we join up, it's 1655. The time is 1650. It's given as 1655. It's cut as per day, you know, 1655. The serial number? The serial number? I'm unable to see the, the, see the serial number. It's not very legible because some of it is, has been chopped off. Can you just place the serial number on record? Air four by less serial number. Air four nine four. The serial number is four nine four. Now go 1655. The time is 1655. Uh, one word investigation out. It is written investigation out. Detective Sergeant Mohani. Uh, Detective Sergeant Mohani. Of National Cold Case Investigation Unit. Of the National Cold Case Co Investigation Unit. With one suspect. Non Goma case, 160 of 10, 2020. Uh, no, 2018. I think one of the mistake I would be 2018. That's one of the 2018. So one of the thinking I'm going to 2020. With one suspect of the Non Goma case of 2018. Maramo, which 160 of 10, 2020. Uh, but on the document, it appears that there's an error where uh, someone wrote uh, 2020. Yes. Bongani Tanzi. Name of Bongani Tanzi. Ukamelwa Bongani Tanzi. Cell 64. Cell 64. Kcp 14. Yabangwa Langwa Chorwa Oyona. Kina number. Kina number 64. Muchorwa number 64. Chachile. Uh, Bongani Tanzi. Bongani Tanzi. Cell 64. Cell 64. Kcp 14. Yabangwa Langwa Chorwa Oyona. Kina number. Kina number 64. Chachile. Also, cell 64 is the number of uh, of the accused on that day. Of 6 2020. Of 6 2020. Then here is a PS 14A, it's a little to pelo chale chaka kaka, perisi pelale. And also the right, the road uh, about SAP 14A, which is uh, his rights, uh, his rights are also following him. To the point, when SAP 14A, you could not imagine that you are going to say, 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 you are going to say
512-66-765 number of the rights is still continuing with him 512-66-765 If you long with your um without in without injuries it is also written without injuries but you have yes there's just read the rest of the information there oh no no uh, you're correct correct received it is written correctly received and I also signed again. Should we put a one gallege gashe and a pinde and a signed a lap? And Ramofa Sagaperonali number four nine eight booked back. Four nine eight? Yeah, she ran number four nine eight booked back. Also, there's a number there four nine eight booked back. Yes, but can you explain to the court was the, what was the purpose of uh, booking him out? What happened there in the boardroom? And I did not much of a way to the it's because there, there were many in cases uh, which he was involved in. Uh, he was involved in the case of the case of the case of the case of the 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 previous night, so we wanted to have a good time to uh, understand properly what, what, uh, about these cases. We should hear. We should go back to the session about the scatter seat. We should lap a session about when the scatter seat is so good. Squares of clock are nine alone. So, Kile Kamu Kamu Chaga Pegaru Toplo Chaga Chago Swariwa. I also again reiterated his uh, his rights. When arrested, I say I'm pinned the foot in the Amkumbosa and Amadungelo Ake, Uma Eboshi. Worrell worry, who I Nako Valela, who Heta Humola, a kill to Gulachara. And I informed him that he has the right to remain silent. And I say I'm Jaluti, I only look at the look too, and I could do. I involve, also informed him that whatever he says can be used against him in a court of law. I said, I'm sure to I'm sure you are such a good any color like a candor. Error Piliki, little Piliki Aqua. Pretoria North, I feel such in my pain. I'm so such in my pain. I feel like I'm such a precarious individual. Or say, "Lo banan tanzi." Well, laga. There's something I forgot to include that before we went to the Pretoria North police station, we informed Brigadier Kininda that we would be going to see him dance. As a colleague, Koshuk Musha, who is the singer guy, he did only. Now, today, I will be catching him in the court. Is it that he did only go on and dance? The Bagalore Mocha for the film team who came here was unit. So, I'm just even telling you, Ridira. The reason for telling him is because he is a unit commander, and he must be informed of everything that is happening. And that's why we want to see the judge. We want to hear him. Now, we must do what he did. We must do it. Finally, we want to go and see him. Ache. Yes. On my arrival, I was brought to the radio. On arrival in the bedroom, we sat down. Safia put on Safia Sasana. Omera muchi shagama la te nongo ma. And then we asked him about this nongo ma case. So this is a buzzer again. I learned that language nongo. In which language were you communicating with him? The very good la pule no ifi la la liana. Na ganchi kishumisha shuwa asizolo le speedi. Most of the time I use English. Zulu and Sibedi. We should take a minute. You can engage in this. This is Zulu and Sibedi. 
Ibila wa wa karuna mu shawa mang. Ife ba mu tswana kwele la tswana. Well, it also uh, depends on who you are. If you speak tswana, I do speak tswana. But I also mix English in there. But regarding Mr. Tanzi, which language did you communicate with him? Mr. Skoa, Sizulu, Mr. Soto, Mr. Tswana. We used English, Zulu, and Tswana. Sasan says, listen, Gisi, this is Zulu, this is Tuan. Yes. O Magilega Mujisha, to Ram Mujisha, Nali Mukuma Bena, or Utsuan Kamala to a Nongoma or Stunyalo. We, that is me to, together with uh, the late Mabena, asked him what he knows yes. about the murder case in Nongoma. Yes. Um. Regarding this matter, what happened? No one had ever a much issue on our only show the religion or one mega up the woman at one. We informed you that there was an informer who informed us that he is involved in this case. Some cousin again, no good to go on our set to the loud ones, no good to wear ticket. Yes. O mekile ka mucha rana o alga ika 26 cha October 2014 na wese zimu abalai abalai wa 26 cha October 2014. We asked him where he was on the 26th of October 2014 when the deceased was killed. Zambo zote wale la pigi mucha 26. Ten for wingat niyangi na October 2014 sasa ne umufi ebula. Ah, o me. He did know about the date of the death of Senzo Mio. Why has he so good a word? So good a word, Senzo Mio. Because no, the time I learned really more the way radio, the TV, I'm going to catch up with the one who is He claimed that he and he knows about this case because it was all over the news. What he get? Yes. Well, when I when I told him that he is uh, a suspect in this case. Uh, I asked him where he was on the 26th of 10th, 2014. I said, I'm going to go back to the 26th, 2014. We are in the Shumongwasivanya still water mine in the western area. He claimed to have been at the Sibanya still water mine in the western area. Yes. What is it? I was in the mine in the Sibanya water mine in the western area. Yes. Well, the legal measure na aka ho na horisha wana mo ba shuma wana mo mining ri lo khonti shor kan niti niti o ba le mero kong. When we asked him if he could take us to the mines to go and verify that indeed he was on duty on that specific day at the mine. So since then I would answer that he must say my in uguti so to speak in South Sudan. Well, now why are you going to my in the seventh and eleventh land? Yes. We like you, Melo Rotary. He agreed to take us there. He did not refuse. Wow, for my way to the status, he's a corner of our Zanga pig. Yes. How many cars are you going to sell to me? Which one of you? See, like, like, while on a ice pillar, we should go there. No, but that's what I was asking. Are you in the reality? Since it was late in the day, and uh, we. Felt that we could not drive that on that road going there. We felt that we're going. We told him that we're going to fetch him the following day to go there with him. 
Baba gave us a good three. Footy gets born to the under and against us, we have. So, as a city, a woman was not to see that what is on Landa, Gayland and Langa. Yes, Ome Kalicha Chilla Tela. Just before that, yes, yes, sorry. Is just interpreted? Yes, and what happened to Mr. Ntanzi? We then took him back to the cell. So, 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 Yes, um, it's on page four, my lord, of exhibit MM. Can you read the relevant entry? Uh, serial number is 498. The serial number is 498. Uh, uh, it is also written the investigation back. In which of Detective Sergeant Mohan of National Cold Case Unit. Uh, Detective um, Sergeant Mohan was the National Cold Case Unit. On long my case one six of ten. I was also in the post of 2018 or 2020. Uh, with the actual uh, case number, there is still a mistake here because it's still written in as 2020. Uh, on which you are born in cell number, serial number, Elia, yes, watch. Number of years, watch. I saw on April 64 of 10, 2020. And he wrote the name and of number of years. Oh, okay. The number, his arrest number, which is 64 of 10 of 2020. Home, more fast, more much of back without injuries, correctly handed, and then sign the rape. At the bottom, it's written. Booked back with no injuries, and then uh, also it is uh, written that he was brought back uh, properly, correctly, and then the sergeant signed as well. We should have had twelve. Who we saw the anger, the mail, footy was a year show. But we saw that we are signing a um signing. Yes. Okay. Well, hello, Anna. Big. So, let's go for the last. For the other guys, let's go for the last. Um, when I'm doing my do my laundry, I'm going to go to my own. I then, of course, is the other guys again and informed him that this the suspect had agreed to take us where he claimed he was working. So, I say, I'm telling you, we search and find out what's going on. Then, don't you for me, we're going to start to see that the agents are coming. Ummi, lihatlah lorong bala. Saya sangat orang yang kalau buat ini, 2020 0680. We went then went home and the following day, which was the kali 18th of June. It was on the 18th of June 2020. Yes. Omega fita kwa diselen rape. I arrived back again in the cells. I feel forty maseleni. Nearly eight fifteen. Serial number five twenty. The time was eight fifteen, and the serial number was five twenty. Omega wingwe cho rape or investigation out. And it's also written there as well, investigation out. We should take part of the footage of what is happening. We are going to be able to open. Okay. 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 I'm going to advocate on a little bit. Okay. I'm unable to see. It is a bit illegible for me to read. Would this be an appropriate time to take the the short agenda? Again, for 15 minutes. 
Serial number 520. 520. Now go 815. The time is 815. Investigation out. Investigation out. Detective Sergeant Mokhani booked out. Oh, so one male suspect. On Nongoma case one sixth of ten twenty eighteen. On Kipa Nongoma. Gan in Tanzi. Oh Bangan in Tanzi. SAP fourteen. SAP fourteen. Uh sixty sixty six or six or can't you call six twenty sixty six. Uh, let's see. Let's see. 60? 64. 64. Yeah, one of them. Yeah, 64 of 6, 2020. Uh, 64 of 6, 2020. Then, yes. the two girls are the rest of the sentence. Sorry? Just read the rest of the sentence. Oh, oh. Mongan in Tanzi, SAP 1466, uh, 6, 2020, SAPS 14A, S1266765, without any injuries. Correctly received. I can sign it up. Yes, what happened after you booked him out? And I informed him that we are going where you work so that you can show us where it is. I am going to say, I and uh, I explained him uh, his rights again to him and I informed him that he still uh, has the right to remain silent. I said, I'm to I said, I said, I said, I I also informed him that whatever he says will be used against him in a court of law. I said, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm going to be a good I'm going to be a I'm going to be a good person. I'm going to He understood. What I said, I'm before we drove across the phone, Brigadier Kininda rapé. Well, before leaving that place, I phoned uh, Brigadier Kininda again. I asked him to phone. I phoned the Brigadier Kininda foot. For a similar real intensi, for a very long one of mining. And I informed him that we are going again with Ntanzi to where he works at the mine. I said, I'm just going to some of Ntanzi. See, lessons are going to mine. Uh, Brigadier Gininda are Wata Utali Sajin Mamru Timahola. And uh, Brigadier Gininda then informed on this us that he was going to come together with uh, Sergeant Mahola. Who's Brigadier Gininda? I said, Chalu to week now, who's also a Hamba no Sergeant Mahola. We then placed him inside the car and then we went with him. Sassam Fagamutu and Samba Nai. Since he was the one that knew the way to Western Nairo, he was the one that was guiding us on how to go there. Because in Western Western area, there are many, many mines. Mind you, if I Western Nairo, it's mine is me. He took us to that specific mine where he worked, and I also see it again. Who the mine is and I sense a girl. What is it called? It's called Sibanya Steel Water. Steel water. It is called Sibanya Steel Water. The mine is this one which is Sibanya Steel Water. Um, 
Come on, Sarah, get the game. It's a bit that you're getting into the office. On arrival, I'll be waited outside the gate, waiting for Brigadier Kininda to arrive. So, speak it like a Pusama, a sanguine cylinder, who Brigadier Kininda would have fee. We love you, as a plally Sergeant Mohola. Indeed, he arrived together with Sergeant Mohola. As if you are a man of Sergeant Mohola. More or less, what time was it? Well, as we will in a woman, example, I really got after no, no, I'm a polar. I really am unable to recall, but it was in the afternoon. I can't really can't recall the time. Saskum would be scared to go to go away in Dambam. Home, uh, Brigadier General Officer Kamutsibisha Ntanzi. And when Brigadier Kininza arrived, I introduced him to Ntanzi. And the time I figured out Kininza, I'm a tool of Ntanzi. Earlier, Brigadier Kininza saw a TV show with an organ among. Brigadier Kininza also uh, introduced himself. Uh, to Kinesa and to me, to me, to me, to me, to to me, 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 to to me, to to me, 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 to to me, to Again, reiterated, reiterated his rights to him. There are the same rights that I, I uh, write for him before we left Pretoria. I could make an eye open again. I do in his awesome fundelam lungle, one alam lungle and fundelona. Sasu will be doing. Oh, my will, I'm much honor. I'm a salutate our overlay. I have a catch lesson to me. I will love. I'm a salutate Jacob. I'm much. Then he asked him, the Brigadier Kineza asked him, Danzi, where he was on the day that Senzo Meiwa was killed. Oh, Brigadier Kineza, I suppose you Danzi, why are you laughing? I don't know if you are Senzo Meiwa. We are much happy, Brigadier Kineza, when Danzi was on the day, he was on the day of Senzo Meiwa. Uh, then he also informed uh, him that he is a suspect in the case, in the murder case of Senzo Mio. As I think that we am chela guti u mso ola kuleli kala le lega Senzo Mio. Tanzi la gana re na tivi si lo valum shumo chakile. Tanzi declined and said he does not know anything because he was on at work on that day. Wah pika ke undang so tagas duto ya na, why semasa ini nggak ada dulu lah. Oh, mereka rasa yang harus pelali ya na, kamu kagak main ni. We went together with him into the mine, sahang kenan ay emai ini. Alamak ya, lepas pin lah human resource. We went to the human resource branch, sasesia, lagu kena, kira kena be human resource. Ume salwa level ni si shamu mangalung abo na kore intansu balo kona chachileo. They checked in their records if intansu was on duty on that specific day. Kwa sababu ya shola inatinza bugu tu intansu yempelo ya kona inemse nzina galelo langa. Wila wakra kore ubasi yao. It was discovered that he was not on duty on that day. Kwa sababu chola lupo inge kemsu nzina galelo langa. Ome human resource manager mana lo kau bila alfa statement tema apa pilih sel? Then the human resource manager gave us the statement with regards to that. Um, open cegah human resources. Wah cegah us ni gay statement di mana lah nana lo? Just to remember his name. So kau boleh sanjelo kau pelal ini nala kau? Nau, that's what you forget. The HR manager. Yes, HR manager. No, I'm unable to recall his name. I think Brigadier Kinenza might be able to record his name. And some Kumbori Kamala Kagota and Gaunt, who Brigadier Kinenza and Gansa would serve Kumbori Kamala. Yes. Ome Erotor Amo, a federal first statement. Brigadier Kininda Gargana swearing case here, Polaria sends me via Fosora 636 of 10 2014. And after that, 
since Brigadier Dagadir Geniza is the one who is in charge of this investigation of the uh, death of Senzo Meiwa in the case 636 of 2014. 10, 2014. Uh, of 10, 2014. Uh, of 10, 2014. 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 Since uh, Brigadier Kinenza was the chief in the case, investigator in this, he, and also the one who had uh, the docket, he then showed in Danzi a picture which was said to be uh, a likeness of him. We just want to show you exhibit BB. Do you recognize that exhibit on the screen? Hey, guess what? Yes, I can see it. Yes. 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 You say an identity kit was shown to dance which one? It is the same one that is on the picture. It's on the it's Yes, which one? Uh, on the left. Uh, it's the one that is on the face. It is the face that is on the left. The one that is wearing a hoodie. You know, denied being at, uh, present at the killing of Senzo Miwa. Uh, um, you, you, you may not dis di disclose what um, was said to Brigadier Gininda that's not uh, admissible. Is it correct? Brigadier Gininda interviewed Mr. Ndanzi. Yes, what happened further? But we la mucha cha mucha ngona mucha chona and then eh go tloga mo ka ka mogho brigade ke na bala go no o mo di tsho ro wa tseba yena go dira ga tshe ga tsha tshile um please don't disclose what he told brigade ra 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 ko paroska wa tseba se bodi jeng eh brigade ke what happened further after the interview that brigade ke ninda had with uh, ntanzi sorry camera or eh uh, um, um, what happened? Uh, Brigadier Kininza uh, informed him of his rights again. Brigadier Kininza opened the office and said, I'm going to go to the office. 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 Uh, informed him that uh, he, whatever he says can be used against him and that he can continue to remain silent. Yes. I said, 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 uh, since he 
After I had finished telling uh, him what he had uh, informed him, I was like, 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 I and then he said, Brigadier uh, Kinesa informed me that he was going to look for somebody that Ndanz uh, was going to be able to uh, to tell him, that person, about the fact that he, Ndanzi, does yes. not know anything about the case that was being. Does not know what's That. Uh, yes, please. Um, Brigadier Kinesa said he'll arrange someone to take down a confession. What yes. happened further? No, we la si pila brigadier kina den den nali ma pena ra chala pila ka kamishomware na brigadier kina then left and then me and ma pena continued with our duty. Har wona kis chidin chelo re bedi me amari la ra si pila inchar peena. And since there were many cases that he was involved in, we continued uh, to make our investigations. And John Bagu Bagu na matola mani ra itinte ra bona sa se kuba ra no peyo luit. From there, we took him back where we had took him at the police station. So, the police station. Which police station? We police station. Which police station? We police police station. Is Pretoria is North. That is the Pretoria North police station. Yes. Uh, on arrival, we then put him back in. Must be a person some far footing apart. Again, he was registered into the books. Which books are you referring to? The book I will learn to next year. It's a occurrence book. It's still the occurrence book. Yes, can you place the relevant entry? Okay. Oh, the moment you Friday, twenty twenty six one nine. On top of the book, it is written Friday, twenty twenty. It is Friday, twenty twenty. Friday was zero six. In June. Galicia nineteen. On the nineteenth. My note is page seven of uh, Exhibit M M. Yes. Um, uh, serial number 530. 531, sorry, 531. Uh, now 2 30 in the morning. The time is 2 30 in the morning. Investigation back. Uh, investigation back. Should you say we, we are boys, sir? Detective Sergeant Mohan of National Court Case Unit book back one suspect. Sergeant Mahale, what was the national court case investigation? Probably some sort of way at one of murder on Nongoma case or sort of Bulala Italian Lago Nongo case number 163 of 6 2018. Mobile in which you would see well, I correct the case number 163 stroke 06 stroke 06 stroke 2018 stroke 2018. Uh, that is the case number 16306 of 2018. In here, it is written correctly. It also continues to, to mention the name of Bongani Tanzi. SAP 1464 stroke uh, 06 stroke 2020. Uh, SAP 64 stroke 06 2020. SAP 14A. And it continues to say SAP for the name. Serial number 5266765. Uh, it also provides the same uh, serial number 512667765. Book back without any complaints or injuries. We said in a party, Kungena Zikalo Futi, Kungena Gulimala. Correctly handed, Aki signed it up. It was correctly uh, handed in and then the sergeant signed again. Footy here, Commissar, would bam Fagagase and Usai Jenny Wapinde was signing.
Ome, Olale, another entry up here, 532. There's also another entry of 532. Yeah, 235. Uh, the time is 235. Suspect chest. Yes. Detective Sergeant Mohani. So you just put the correct uh, time there. Oh, record. 235. It's not 235. 0235. 02 or 0235. Yes. Suspect charged the detective Mo Sergeant Mohan of National Cold Case Unit. Charged one male suspect of murder on Mongoma. Case 163 of 6 2018. Uh, of which now he wrote the wrong case number again. Supposed to be 163 of 10, 2018, the month there. Which one are the Sergeant Mokale, what are the Tessa, um, what's the Lisa, eight Tala, eight Tala Lake, 163 of six foot of a pindle? Why, Pala, when's the April tech pile in the league, the case in the ass, one longer? If you let more entry here, 51, as I got one of the one case here, we made it wrong. It's 2163 of 10, 2018, not 163 of 6, 2018. Uh, if you're so chilling, entry, uh, most of the number 51, where it says, booked back one male suspect of murder on number my case, 163, though it was about 163 of 10, 2018, not 163 of 6, 2018. There was also a mistake in in the serial number 531, where it was supposed to be 163 of 10 of 2018. It was written as 163 of 6, 2018, which was a mistake. Yeah. So, I put it in the same way. We found out that 163 of 10 of 2018, we found 163 of 6, 2018. So I'm going to entry 532. So I'm going to enter 532. 01, uh, Bongan in Tanzi, cell 64 of stroke 62020. So I'm going to enter in Tanzi, foot of cell 64 of 62020. SAP 14A. So SAP 14A. 5126675. 5126765. Charged correctly. To a high way to a swagger. Without any complaints or visible injuries. Correctly I charged, I signed. I go call as colors of footage. To a swagger. It's a lot. What's the sign that you say? Then Robali entering the rapid Friday twenty. There's also 20. another entry on that very same Friday. Yeah, twenty twenty six nineteen. Serial number five thirty four. Serial number five thirty four. And now we're zero four fifty. Mind you, the police got this city 0450. You never got to lie. Prisoner transferred. Detective Sergeant Mohan of National Court Case Unit with one male. Mind you, I'm sorry again. I'm going to say 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 with one male suspect of murder. Why I'm going to say I'm going to say Oh, to say it all, no gubulana. Nongoma one six three of six twenty eighteen. The case number. Woman, to say it all, the number nongoma one six three of ten twenty eighteen. Then we have a case here. One bungani mkanzi cell six four zero six twenty twenty stroke zero six stroke twenty twenty. Woman, to get sure get up and go to bungani mkanzi cell six four of six twenty twenty. SAP 14A 5126765. You have pinned the photograph for a serial number. It is uh, SAP 14A 5126765. Transfer to Phosphorus Court without any injuries or complaint. Well, to the survey, a Phosphorus Court in the Mele, footy in the Skal. 
Happy in which all quality transferred Kisan Rape. Footy, Padian, or what you would to the Serra say, or Pindo sign of Sajin. Yes, what happened then? Was it the run? Ome Rilam Giarape, Ratamale and Ranakeo, Rea Corti. We then took him at the time and went with him to court. So, some Tata Sambana is in Gandolo. Is it a first law court? First law court, yes. Yes, that is in the first law court indeed. Yeah, but why you want to the first law Yes. The early delay in Cabo past five, between five and half past five. Cafona Laki, Brigadier Gininda. And uh, when we were on our way uh, between five and half past five, we got a call from uh, Brigadier Kininza. She said, I sent the lane and go five to half past five. She said, I told her, who can go to the fellow with Brigadier Kininza? William Pujaro, who gave him to Agatian confession in Tanzi. He informed us that he had found someone that was going to be able to take the confession of Ndanzi. Why is that so good? Who told her? Omundo onga la le la unda nsi uma evu ma iso. Pili rea kote fasi la serefite Morocco police station. Before we went to for the stores, we went via the Morocco police station. Sina ige fasi la sasa la ngase Morocco police station. Ome orile elitafita rekere. Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu. Uh, he said we are going to find the Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu. Who uh, was going to receive and Danzi Danzi's uh, confession? Twelve police officers told him who Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu. Why you are like that? Oh, and Danzi, a woman is son. Oh man. No, and then Colonel Kebregadil Gininda have a Adira arrangement silly when Rapadu receiving the Atla. And then that Green Kadir Gininda then made arrangements with Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu informing him that we're on our way. Lapoge, Colonel Gininda, or such a law, Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu, which is sent the lane is here, sir. Kawa and Woraki, Fonella, eh. But what are what are escort and we are caught the law of Morocco? I then uh, arranged for escort from uh, from Morocco police station to the court. I say, the labors of Pelas are also a Morocco police station. See, a court. No, who did you phone? 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 Uh, officer Jablan Butelezi. Uh, I spoke to Officer Jablan Butelezi. Because he was one in charge of the Egurulen uh, Metro uh, Police Escort. We are now going to OIA Pete Benza, I'm an escort. I'm Pelezel. That's why I'm Gurulin. Really, I'm going to carry my self for a gas phone to run at the gas station in Pretoria. I'm going to carry my Albert on Motilin. We then offer my Albert. We then had an agreement that since it was still early, he wasn't going to come and fetch us from Pretoria, from Pretoria, but he was going to wait for us in Albert. I said, "I'm going to ask the same thing. I'm going to ask the same thing. I'm going to ask the same thing." Ome ota romela grupe ni yaga e inangli gori romela kwa Morocco. He then said he was going to send another group which was going to wait for us at Morocco police station. I said you zo tumai ali inkambili zo sika na nati Morocco. Ome grupe ni yale Morocco ni yale officer Jonathan. Mind you, now those that were in Morocco were all. Officer Jonathan, uh, uh, together with his colleagues, and the Lapa Gay Moroka, Officer Jonathan, and Abanya Gahas and Sanana. Our candidate, Rakopanali, or Namutilin, and Sangara Noye, Magarbarboni, then Barlatela. And we then joined them on the way 
because they we did not stop. They actually saw us and then they followed us. I go back to be Kumana Nathan Delena. As I see, me go over with the basketball and basketball be be a slandy. Official agent. Who are referring to? Uh, officer Chabulan Butelezi and, and his group. I'm referring to Officer Chablan Butelezi and his group. Kuruma Officer Chablan Butelezi, Nate Mbalan. Ome gare tsena ga gare ga shwe to gare go bona le college di nchi go bona le ba le mopile ba re bulela tsela. See when we entered Soweto since there were many uh, there was a lot of traffic they went ahead of us clearing the traffic for us. Te uma singa na ga Soweto wa go ne mo te ninge go bona we hamba nga phambili ga pese vule le ntle. O fitla la re fitla Morocco police station. Until we reach the Morocco police station. So fika ga e Morocco police station. Ome kile ka phone la kape brigadier ginindor awuche to left hand side la pa do rifisile. Then called left hand colonel ginindor again to ask him to inform left hand colonel Rapadu that we had arrived. Yes. Ome Lieutenant Kaba Rapadu will have all along now. Who do you think I am at the police station? Then Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu informed us where exactly he was sitting within the police station. Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu was just there to go to Ushali, the Langa Party, who is coming to Sama Police. Ome Kaba Kaka Kopela, Officer Jonathan, Metro Police, Koroleni. I then asked uh, Constable Jonathan of the Metro uh, Police of Egorileni that he must be the one that takes Ndanzi uh, to Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu. The reason for requesting that it be Constable Jonathan that takes him to Rapad was because the, uh, Constable Jonathan did not have any knowledge about the case that we were investigating. Ome Officer Jonathan Salatia Tanza Mishaka Colonel Rapadu. Colonel Constable Jonathan took Ndanzi to the office of Lieutenant Colonel Rapadu. Constable Jonathan Walter Tiger Mundan, so Mr. Elvis, the guy left in Colonel Rapadu. Will you attend a little like soon and about you, Chicago? Attend a little woman, a war up here to Emmanuela Mokului. He went in, I don't know where they were sitting, but then after that, he came back and sat with us in the car. One day, I'm a little power to him, but I was a boy's or shall I not? He's Mudwin. Yes. Well, I'm I'm not coming to see. Hello, Ronaldi. Confession is what you want, or 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 Ronaldi pointing out. I'm not sure if you're lying or not, officer. I'm not sure if you're lying. Can I arrange a number? Only I'm not sure if you're lying. When there is a confession that has to be taken, or where there has to be appointed out, the person that is going to participate in that, or the person that is going to be responsible for that, is the one that gives us instruction on how they prefer it to be done. Yes. Yes, what happened further? Uh, Okay, uh, uh, Officer Jonathan William Alarena. Officer Jonathan stood with us, Officer Jonathan Wamanati. And then Rafaita Agsona U Utsibilema or Ufidi and Tatukos, a dancing one as she chamlata Italian. Support the Colonel Rapa Rumu Filipo number of Unilan. I do not know how he got to know that they were finished. <coughs> Because what we just saw is we just saw him coming back uh, with him. Uh, I then surmised that it is possible that uh, Lieutenant Kendall Rappard had exchanged phone numbers with him. 
Then when uh, Danzi came back, I asked him if he was still fine, if, if he doesn't have any problem, and he confirmed that there was none. Uh, mm -hmm. We then got into the cars and went to the Fosloras uh, courts. <coughs> Yes. On our way to Fosloras, I then called the brigadier and told him that we had finished and that we were on our way to Fosloras. Uh, where we then discussed with Brigadier Kininza and said that since this suspect has many cases and uh, that the Nongoma uh, case is a case from very far away kenge lapho sakumana cliff no brigadier kene somtjalo ukuthi njoba ke umsolwa ena maqala manenge futhi ke leli lase em kwale lalaka nongoma kuyiqala la kude sizokhulumana nomshushisi wase fosloras ora na karona le emalato mongape wa di drugs gape oloro khatlana ngule yena and uh, we then said that since you do, uh, the accused also has other cases that involve drugs. So, school man, we say, um, so I can jump on. Why are you doing it? Why are you peddling in this tagamiswa? Yes, from what are the details of that case? Uh, from from which area? It is the first Loras case 274 of 6-2020. Yeah, 274 of 6-2020. Of June 2020. 271. 271, no? 271 of 6-2020. Of 1st Loras. Should you tell us if 1st Loras is 274 6-2020? Yes. Omer, I think I'm going to uh, and we agreed with the prosecutor that uh, we discussed with the prosecutor that since the Nongoma case was very far, we're just going to uh, place this uh, Fosloras case. Uh, and, and that's the one that we're going to deal with. So today, Did you have the Nongoma case docket with you? Yes, we had it. You have to get it. Yes. Yeah, we may a much more than a couple of years. We are not going to see jurisdiction here. I guess we want to come over. We want to go here. We are for sure. I see. Yeah, let me. Then the prosecutor said, "Is it as a court cases?" Is that? Yeah. As a court cases. Which 
case receive attention at the first Lawrence court? Also, last case two seven one of six twenty twenty. That is the uh, first last case two seven one of six twenty twenty. We should hear about first last it's a little and you are last of us two seven one of six twenty twenty. Yes. So let me then what happened regarding that case. Uh we love a did I lang crazy you uh so little no uh is a documentation regarding how this case was handled. Uh, meaning when I want to more waiting OB. Uh, the, a. There is somewhere where it is um, um, recorded in the OB. Yes. Instead, refers you to exhibit UU1 and UU2. Can you give your evidence using those exhibits? Will be entries from First Lawrence Court cells. Yes, this is one. I'm still looking for the UU2. I'm still looking for that exhibit. Because can I look at this book? I don't have the 14. I have an occurrence book. I'm not sure whether it is. The book we're looking for. It's, it's bound will assist me. Start with UU2. What is the entry there on exhibit UU2? Exhibit UU2. What are you Friday, 2020. It is written Friday, 2020. <coughs> Yes. Yes, in which we see the quality of Friday, 202619. Omela Tela Kisir and Lamba. On top is written 26. Uh, Friday, so it's Friday, 202619. Yes. Ela Tela Kisir and Lamba 200. That is followed by the serial number 200. Now, okay, 1232. And uh, the time is 1242. 1232. 1232. Prisoner received? Uh, one, uh, received one prisoner SAP 14. Uh, that's, that's supposed to be the case, not the SAP 14. No, no, so sorry, it's SAP 14. Uh, yeah, 271 of 6214. No, okay, case A, 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 and not yes, yes. correct it. Uh, okay. Yes, yes. Okay, received one prisoner space AP 14 of 6 2020 from Pretoria North. 
And then SAP 14, in which on the serial number 271, Tanzibongani. Number 271, Tanzibongani. Mimara Ero, a more in which a gender male. Number Kopalu to a slicer. Day 26 of 6, 26 stroke of 19. Monday, you come inside the house, so we'll be going to 26, which one, 2019? 1232. Scattered 1232. You read it from uh, exhibit UU1, is it? UU1, right? yes. The register. Yes. And then the case number 534 of 6, 2020. Pretoria case number 534 of 6, 2020. From Pretoria North. Evela, a Pretoria North. No, 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 I can't force us, but this person is from Pretoria North. In case you have a force of us, you can pull your mood off Evela, a Pretoria North. Yes. Then, as time goes, the date of release is 26-19. Uh, my dear, the date of the year, the year 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 of the year. 13-30. How about it? 13.30. At go half past one. Uh, reason for release, not in road. So I go in in the games, which I could do, which I go in the game. And uh, the next place is to be taken to Primrose, SAPS. My dear, I go in the game, I say Primrose, SAPS. Do you know as why the case was not in Rome? Was there a case that was in charge of the case? Uh, was there a case that was in charge of the case? Yes. Uh, in order to give you a short answer. What was written? Was there an entry in the... Yeah, it was made. ...in the diary? Yeah, it was made. What was the entry? It was made in the diary. So... As a court, please. It's just the entry in the diary. Yeah, I want that. You know, like South Borong, which is Marong, which is was in a Lusa Felela Lusa Transferred Diary. Well, there is a diary, but there are some things that she said were outstanding. But you have a court diary. Got a court diary. I'm a paper. Ah, be inga inga kapi di konga. This is kind. Can you just please make the docket available? Sorry. Can you make the docket available? Yes, we'll. I'll ask. To be in there, to be more intelligent. Yes, I will make sure that the docket is available. So when I go to that docket, it will arrive. Yes. What happened then after after the proceedings there at Postores Court? To where I am still at? To where I will be now? To where I go to Postores Court? Really, I want to get some massage. We realized that it was still during the day, it was not yet dark. Someone was going to the work system in the Sakai. I was able to get a job in the Sakai. I was able to get a job in the Since we are still continuing with the same case on which we were, we were able to get a job in the Sakai. I was able to get a job in the Sakai. I was able to get a job in the Sakai. I call the Gadir Kininza. I call the Gadir Kininza. I don't know if I'm going to be a good one. 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 He then should go back to Pukeng where he was staying to go and try and find the hoodie that he was wearing. It's the same one that seems to appear in the photo. Yeah, well, I was actually a son. They say, Lay Pukeng, so I saw the light that I can do. Which is not all in the hood, the Aiko Gil, and you can leave Vela at his tomb. Omerilera Sepelara Puking. We then proceeded to go to Puking. That's the same Kubega, I guess, yeah, Epuking. That's now you and who? We will do another man. La Constable Mapen, the late Mapen, Sajel Mamuri de Mohola, Brigadier Gininda. It was Brigadier Gininda, me, uh, the late uh, Sajel Mapen, and uh, Sajel Mohola. Mohola. Were you all traveling in one vehicle? No, no, my motor to level Safaraga Kuleti. We were traveling in two cars, so some of my motors in beat. 
Yes, how are you traveling? Me uh, and my were in together in one car. And then uh, Sergeant Mokholali Brigadier Gininda was a black hole. Sergeant Mokholali and Brigadier Gininda they were together in their own car. So they mean again, no. My pen and Tansi Sassi Samo twenty eight. Oh, Brigadier Gininda, no Mokhola. Babe Hambange Abi Mord. Which vehicle were you using? I was uh, using a Toyota Fortune. So it's a Fortune. Uh, um, uh, I saw Palabo, Tsori, Sergeant Polali Brigadier, Ginin, and Vashumisha Golf 7. I'm unable to recall whether or not it was that uh, Sergeant uh, Mohola and Brigadier Kininza were using a Golf 7. <laughs> Yes. So that be No, how many of us have been injured? We have been in Tanzania. Well, we then proceeded to go with in Tanzania. There were no problems. He appeared um, affable and happy. How many of us have been to go to the police station? We then arrived at the police station again in Pugain. So let's just figure out if the police station is in Pugain. We then asked the police there again to accompany us to the residence of Ndansi. So this time, who is with us? Pin the spell is there. Now, shall I go to Ndansi? We indeed gave us escort to go to uh, to that place in Pugeng. So this spell is there. Now, who is there? Better go on down. It's Pugeng. And when we arrived, it was already dark. Must be a lot of work. Was it free? Um, Tanzu had his key as a play carrier. I'm not putting it around. Tanzu had his key in his pocket. And Tanzu, eh, no key. I walk in. Was a cool queen. Can I give me a coffee? Let me hope I don't run past key. I can pull it in for you. And since he was handcuffed, I asked him to give me his the key to his house. Go back to wife for goes and goes and tell what I am going to kill in the act. Um, me era bula ratena. We then opened and went inside. So she bula sengena. We also na mule karvela ga bula siro tekele. Ah, his girlfriend was not there on that day. In the biaka inge konga dero langa. Um, me ratena le na le sajen mukola. We then went in together with him, with Sergeant Leo uh, Mokola, Sergeant, Ma Angena, Sergeant Mapena. We went to the Sergeant Mapena. Mapolis are Pugain. No, Mapolis are when they the Pugain police. So we went to the Sergeant Mapolis are Pugain, no, both Sergeant Mokola, no Mapena. Brigadier Gina na chichu kole inga phone. Eh, Brigadier Gina stayed in the car and we made calls. So Brigadier Gina na wa shali mo tuini wa shau tuini. When we went into his house, we asked him for permission to search for that hoodie that uh, is like the hoodie that is in the picture. We like uh, 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 no, we like and he gave us permission also to search for uh, we conducted the search in his presence. That's the sincere search. Hey, Con. John, we don't want to do the. We are not going to call a call any. We are not going to call any. We are not going to stop being sad. There were some hoodies of several colors, but the, we did not find the one that has the color that is in the picture. Oh, so I bought a new hoodie. I'm not going to buy another one. As long as it's only the number one that's to be.
apologies, my lord. I was delayed. Okay. <coughs> Yes, but please, my lord, um, Sergeant Mukhani can continue. When we adjourned, you mentioned that you sought Mr. Ntanzi's permission to search for a hoodie, and you found hoodies of different colors, but not the one that you were looking for. What yes. happened further? correct. <coughs> Well, I then, as I was looking inside amongst these clothes, I found the plastic that had some metals. And tell me, the plastic, the plastic, is apparent. Plastic, and so? It was a black plastic. What was plastic in your so where, where in the in the room were you looking? I'm uh, about drop. I was looking within the wardrobe. Huh? When was I dropping? Yes. We did. 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 We when I uh, took out the plastic and opened it, in terms of vula, you keep the plastic in vula. Inside, I found some bullets. The part I told her is in town. How many? Uh, if I'm not making a mistake, they were 13. And the caliber? And uh, the caliber I told her. Uh, it's a rifle. They were rifle rounds. But we in time for this primary school. Yes. We are much aware of our language. We are very good at learning Kanali. We are very good at copying and learning. Then I told him, sir, how was looking for a hood? I'm now meeting. I'm, I'm now finding this. I'm asking him, sir, what I want to take it. We are not going to find a hood. You need to make sure that you are listening. Hello, human and devil. He just kept quiet and looked at me. And then I said, now, since I was looking for a hood and now I'm finding this, I'm going to arrest you for it. But do you have a license for this? Yes. 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 Since you are coming from the rural areas, you may be having a very large gun for yes. for shooting animals. Yes. So, when you go to Makai, some news from school, a song to Bula is a loan. A palagota loan. He failed to answer, to 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 explain. I was on a bus of class. I will make a swaraka military, a military up the Togola Charita of Sariva. And then I arrested him and I read him his rights. From there, we closed his room and went to the Pugang police station. La 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 I then opened a case to, for a day for having ammunition without a license. I think I'm going to be like that case became the Pukan case. 118. 118. Stroke 06. Stroke 06. 2020. 2020. I'm going to be like that case. I'm going to be like that case. 
On me dit les Romaliens n'ont pas peur d'aller en outing primaire aussi. And then we went back with him and went to the Chinese primaire outing primaire aux police station. So this is why I say we are nice. I'm about to say a primaire aux police station. Just a minute before you proceed. You mentioned that you charged him for possession of uh, ammunition. Was he processed at the cells at Pukeng? Uh, you know, we just uh, registered him in the OP, but he didn't go into the cells of Pukeng. Just want to show you a document exhibits PP1. Can you open it? Exhibit PP1. Do you recognize that entry? Well, I do. Hello. Here you go. Yes, I can see. Okay. Go. Put the particulars on record. Uh, <laughs> Then lapo zero zero stroke four zero. The time is zero zero four zero. In which our suspect detained. It is written the suspect detained. Detective Sergeant Mohan of National Cold Case Investigation detained. Cell number two nine four of six twenty. Bongan in Sandy Zontanzi. It uh, <coughs> shows how Detective uh, uh, Morale of the National Cold Case Unit detained uh, uh, Mr. Ntanzi. Morale in Ntanzi, on Pugin case 118 stroke 6 stroke 2020. On the Pugin case 118 of stroke 6 of 2020. Was it like, come to say, go to Umukalo as a national uh, cold case unit, Uwa Bopa, Umusolo, Ubongani, Ogandansi, a color edit 118 or 6 of 2020. Possession of a live ammunition. But in Apoga, Wembopela Ubani in terms of this family. Notice of rights as per SAPS 14 number. But again, again, Namalunga, the one for the law corner, and again, general number A, but see, SAPS 14. Number 5094. The number I can go with is 0094 7284. 7284. Read and explain to the accused. But you are from the Alamalunga, from the Lomso. And understood and detained with no injuries. Why was the Sisari Lamalunga? Why is it a Correctly detained by me, signed. Uh, Sergeant P. V. Mohan. Yes, Kuba, I guess you two are Valeda and me and Sergeant Mohale, and they were sick assigned. I just want to show you an exhibit, exhibit LL. I think you know, this is an exhibit LL. Can you identify it for the court? Sorry. Notice of rights in terms of the Constitution. But he says this is a malunge lo. Yes. Which document is that exhibit LL? Document I use for engaging. He did talk about his rights. It is his rights of arrest. Yes. The particulars of the person. Yes. Okay. More personal certificate by detainee. Mungani Sandi Sontanzi. Uh, right there it uh, says, uh, it, it mentions the name of uh, Ndanzi. I will go Ndanzi, name of this hereby certified that I've been informed in English. Statement 
date language of my rights in terms of constitutional as set out above by Sergeant Mohani. Name of a person who informed the detainee. That I understand the contents. Date of date. 2020 06 19 Time 2245 Place Pugin. And then Yes. And then And then Underneath uh, the uh, suspect signed he, and the suspect is Mr. Danzi. And Kamo Wola Raiti Usainilin Nam Mohani. And uh, as well the uh, Sergeant Mohani signed. Yes. You, you just read out the serial number of the notice of rights. Yes. The serial number on, on exhibit LL, how does it compare to the one that you just read out in exhibit uh, PP1? S zero nine four seven two eight four. Yes. How does it compare to the one that did you read? Yeah, it's the same. But well, at uh, the first letter, I thought it's five. I thought it's five. That's why I said it's five. But it's S. Yes. It's uh, the same. Just that the only uh, the alphabet. Leo number here found which means I'm going to five. We can do S zero nine four seven two eight four. Yes. We want to show you exhibit <coughs> PP2. There is a the exhibit PP2. The cell register. We should take a look at the cell register. Yes, entry 294. Can you just put that on record? Uh, entry 294, Bongani Sandi Sontanzi. Age 29. Gender male. Date 19 of 6. Uh, now, uh, time 2245. Offense, position of unlicensed ammunition. Case 118 of 6, 2020. Notice of rights. S094 947284. Date detained 2006. Uh, 0045. And here it says date of release. You can see clearly. It is fine. Lapo Bella, meaning when you go for sure, go on solar and dance. The air show is cut over two forty five. A who should go shallow by name Dango is in a come to train of Kishagan. Number they tell us one oh one one eight of six of twenty twenty and the gas again in a number ye paper la malunga to S zero nine four seven two eighty four. Yes, you may continue. So you proceeded to Primrose. Yes, address transferred to Primrose, SAPS. Where he was detained. Why long as we are on? He was then detained in Primrose, was in Valero, Primrose. Was he then transferred from Pukeng to to Primrose? Can you? Well, ah, Sibijo, Ajo, Kwa, Pukeng, Aisha, Primrose. That is correct. He ever gone there? And just for the record, where is Primrose Police Station? Uh, Primrose, Primrose, Iga. In Johannesburg. Primrose in Johannesburg. Eh, Primrose is a good. Yes. What happened there at Primrose Police Station? Who did I join the Primrose Police Station? No, I don't know. 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 We placed him there because there were many other cases that we're still investigating him on. Some people are like, I don't know. 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 And then, uh, um, uh, Rabara, um, we shall call the rapid cooking. And then we took him to the Pukeng, to Pukeng, where he was going to appear in, the, in court there. Yes. Before you proceed to that aspect, 
what, what happened when you arrived at Primrose? What was it to see? I had to go Primrose. I had to go to Primrose. I had to go to Primrose. I had to go to Primrose. What happened there at Primrose was what happens in every police station where they received him and then they entered him in their box. When they go for now, you know, we go on the police station with my bum girl moon, bam, bala, and nothing. Yes, which box? Occurrence book at the selling. It is a sell occurrence book, which is the occurrence book at Sama Selling. The uh, SAP 14A. Also the SAP. No, no, sorry, SAP 14. Also in the SAP 14. Now go into Python and SAP 14. I just want to show you exhibit QQ. Okay. Uh, can you have a little SAP? The uh, more exhibit QQ, sorry, exhibit QQ. Can you place those entries on on record? Big mm. with No, 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 actually. Thank you. I'm, I'm still One trying more. to find it. All right. Uh, in which way are we? Okay, uh, in which over uh, Saturday 2020, stroke 06, stroke 20, serial number 87, no, 87, 181, now for 480, 04, not JP prisoner received. Warrant of Samukwen received one unit SP Wangan in Tans SAP 14 156 of 6 2020 on Puken case 1186 118 of 6 2020 SAP 14A 5094 7284 from Sajan Mohani National Investigations Pretoria. For the younger community, I know to have a song in number like in the way on 871 is cutting well 480. Actually, I know which one of some going on. I'm getting a little one eight of six of 2020. In fact, pardon any in the lingua. Yes, Tulapina. Okay, there was no entry regarding injuries. What was the position? No, it, the issue of injuries was not mentioned here. Yes, but, but what was the position? Did he have any injuries? No, he had no injuries. When are the men? Yes, then the next entry. Uh, Sunday. The next entry was for Sunday. 2020 06 uh, 21. Uh, serial number. No, sorry. On the 21st of June 2020. 2020. 2020. Uh, serial number 2029. Serial number is 2029. Now for 2250. The time was 2250. You never look at it like a sergeant or suspect charged. Yeah, it says there's the suspect charged. Sergeant Mohale from National Court Case Investigation charged one black male suspect, Mungan Ndanzi, for court. Who was Sergeant Mohale was a National Court Case Investigator. Where to say um soda um Ndanzi? SAP S P S fourteen. Jenga, Pali, we go SAPS 14. 136. 136. 06. 06. 2020. 2020. Yeah, Pukian case, 118 of 6, 2020. The Pukian case is 118 of 6 of 2020. To the Pukian case, 
the number there for 2029 is catch is got 2250 so uh and the time and then it's a lot bigger 1186 of 2020. Once again, there is no entry regarding injuries. What was the position? Uh, no, he was not injured. He was a clean man. Read the entry below that at 2300 hours. Uh, this one is a serial number 2020. Sales visited? Yes, uh, 2300. Sales visited by Sergeant Kava and Constable Makutu. Ten units in custody, no complaints. Okay, but uh, the seller delay But I'm a seller Oh, Sergeant Kava, no me a number now. I won't get another card. Yes, you may proceed. Um, uh, the closure of the guy the 2022. Yeah, escort duties. Hello, Thomas, the number 26, 265. Now, go 715. You're never like escort duties. Detective Sergeant Mohani from National. Paul Chris escorted one unit as per SAP 14136 of 62020. Ungan in Tanzi, case 118 of 62020. He was taken to Savannah Image Rest Court. Lana Pare, which you take the session of an award, Perezela, yet of Ungan in Tanzi, and Perezela, and Savannah Court. And then we took him and went with him to Shabani. So this is somebody nice. Somebody nice. Shabani. Once again, there's no entry regarding injuries. What was the position? Happy about Mala for the Una Lee Ukovichika by Yan. No, he was not injured. Yes. And we took him to Savannah and then they took the docket to the prosecutor. So if you want some to the Samisa de Savannah um shushis was a touch to get by so easy to get um shushis. Are we in a pale covid savani it's a little marvashu melagamonke? because it was the time of COVID, Savannah was closed and they were working outside. I must feel a lot of the total to eat. Savane for the always got the COVID. Babison Zelampa. Oh, Miss Alba Mamorella by Indrona Togetti. They are well received him and they received the docket. As a mem get an etoget yaki. Oh, by postponer to the twenty, by postponer to the twenty. Sabar 29, I'm not sure. Sabar, sabar, sabar. 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 Sabar, sabar, In which to charge sheet flag start. It's written charge sheet flag start. But in which charge sheet flag start? Ome inali pa odi minali case case a a a one seven one stroke one seven one stroke twenty stroke twenty police station Puking. Police station is Puking. Case number one one eight six. Of 2018 of 6 2020. The case is 118 of 6 of 2020. Investigation officer Sergeant Mohani. Uh, the investigation officer appears as Sergeant Mohani. Uh, district. Yes. Uh, what, what is the place of uh, trial? 
and the date of his appearance? Uh, 2020 stroke 6 2022. 2020 or 6 2022. 2022. Yes, and the name of the accused? Uh, the name of the accused was Bongani Sandi Sontanzi. Bongani Sandi Sontanzi. Address Nongoma. If you can turn to page four, if you come from the first page. So which date was the matter postponed? Uh, to, to page four. How about the matter page in Matomo? I will fetch a page of one more. But earlier I was such a marvel or ilo. The, the first postponement to the 3rd of 8, 2020. It was postponed to the 3rd of 8, 2020. What is the date of uh, postponement? Uh, oh, you know, I changed the 29th of 6, 2020. I to the 29th of 6, 2020. Yes. And whilst we're still on exhibit R, there were several appearances. Can you get to the appearances of the 13th of July, 2020? the appearance the 13th of July, 2020. It's the sixth page when you start from the beginning. Yes, the sixth page. Uh, it was postponed to the sixth of July, 2020. Yes, Yes, he was, he was accompanied by me. You have a go with me now, I'm happy, Salah. On the proceedings of the 13th of uh, July 2020, can you indicate, according to the record, who was appearing on behalf of the accused? Okay, man, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to defense accused one, Mr. Mujiyako. But uh, um, the accused, the, the, the representative for the accused was Mr. Mujiapo. And it's written digitally recorded. Just read what stands beyond or below that digitally recorded. Here, Mr. Mujiapo request postponement to the 3rd of 8, 2020, in discussion with the DPP. And again, on the next page, the appearances of the 3rd of August 2020. Uh, the appearances of uh, it was on the who was appearing for the accused? Kima Ovaim, a very memed one, Mr. Mjiako Ape. It was Mr. Mjiako again. Bobo Bum Chiago food. The proceedings of the 17th of August 2020. Uh, 17th of August 2020. In which Mr. Mijiako Mara Ubaseo? It is written Mr. Mijiako, but he was not present. But who is Mr. Mijiako? Next page proceedings of the 20th of August 2020. Who, who was on record for the accused? Uh, 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 it was also <coughs> Mr. Mijiako. It was also Mr. Mijiako, Ubam Mijiako. And just below digitally recorded, can you place and record what's written there? Here, Mr. Mejiako, accused abundance of bail, uh, uh, accused abundance application for bail. 
Umutuagi la poge. Umso lo wanga ba ucha fagiskelo sepe. Proceedings of the 5th of October 2020 uh, was appearing for the accused. Umani wa next page. Wa mela umso lo umse wa 5th October 2020. Misali Mr. Mijiago rapen. It remains Mr. Mijiago. Also Mr. Mijiago. And the proceedings of 11 November 2020. Uh, he still remains Mr. Mijiago, who is representing him. Yes, and lastly, proceedings of 26 November 2020. Uh, he is still Mr. Mijiago, but he did not uh, arrive. Yes. Thank you. We will get back to Mr. Njiaku later on. Yes. You may proceed. We got you, Lapid. Rome, RFA, Jagua, Ravali, and after we postponed it. We came back with him after they had postponed. Sabia and I again for which he says he's so tall. And then. Uh, that, that is now on the 22nd. 22nd of June 20, 2020. Really, 22nd of June 2020. Yes, yeah, I got the I look, 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 I well, we returned with him, but I don't remember which which police station. So as well, and I move out, and so come along to Sam, and I say we police station. Just want to show you exhibit SS and entry from Pretoria Mood Police Station. Entry are those as per exhibit SS? Yes, sir. Who the more exhibit SS scheme? Monday, 2020 of 6 2022. On top is written Monday, 2020. Monday, 2020. Maraki, 2020. Hoya, Silela. Twin Galicia, Masumama, we deal with Jimmy. On the 22nd of June. 2020. Serial number more fascinating. 1661. The serial number is written as 16661. 1661. 1561. 15 hours. 15.00. The time is uh, 15 hours. You want to see prisoner received? Sergeant Mohane from National court case unit of Pretoria handed in. Sergeant Mohana was a national court case unit cell. What are you talking about? One male, Bongani Sandis on Tanzi. I'm going to talk about the OS Lisa Bongani in Tanzi. Pukeng Cass, 118 of 6, 2020. Okay, so say Pukeng 118 of 6, 2020. Position of position of unlicensed ammunition. Which we are not allowed to carry. 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 We the 22nd of June 2020. SAP 14, 108 of 6, 2020. The SAP 14 of 108 of 6, 2020. 
108 108 stroke 06 06 2020 2020 yes and you like to sap 14a and uh, what follows is the sap 14a s094 s094 7284 7284 in which are Bongan Tans without any visible injuries. It also written Bongan Tans without any visible injuries. And, and he confirmed. And for Tigan Niagara, while it is Prince of Salo. Handed correctly, Gasai Narape. Which is one Nigas Elwaga, or Pino Sain. This is now after the appearance in Kabani on the on the 22nd of June, 2020. <laughs> Again, it. it is correct. And is it correct that this is now the entry from Pretoria Mode Police Station? And more could it give more anguish to Uncle Pretoria Mode Police Station? Then it. That is correct. We are in our four corner in Pretoria Mode Police Station. Yes, what is the next relevant entry? More one day happy, Morgan. Every Wednesday. 24th of June 2020. Uh, 24 of June 2020, we will start to. Serial number 1826. Serial number 1826. Now for 1320. Scott, you go with 1320. In which you have an investigation out. Yeah, but I will try to Sergeant Mohale out with one male national court case investigation. So, um, Sergeant Mohale up um, and um, um, to a a o a o pega eh o was upay ni kala. Bogan intansi. Oa kisho bogan intansi. SAP fourteen. SAP fourteen Nancy. One zero eight. One zero eight. Stroke zero six. Stroke zero six. Stroke twenty twenty. Stroke twenty twenty. Case. 118 of 6 2020. So I come a little one one in a one one eight or six twenty twenty. Without injuries and no complaint. Correctly received. Can you now tell the court in your own words what was the purpose of signing out the accused? Uh, we're taking him out to go and uh, make a confession uh, as arranged by uh, Brigadier Gininda. So some people go to Iyo for me kala. Iyo for me sana njenga ba kuagulu niswage o brigadier kinin. Ole retsama elena rimishe boxback magistrate court. We said we should take him to the boxback magistrate court. What take us into the simise? A boxback e ma uvi sigama. Ome recepijele na rape. We went with him again. Saha bana ifuti. That is you and who? Oh, when I know about you, Billy, and Alima, and a Sergeant Mabena. It was me and Sergeant Mabena. What we mean, a Sergeant Mabena? The rest called Taki, a Corolini Metropolis, the Metropolis. We are escorted by the Ugrulin Metropolis, as well as all our Mapoys are escorted as Ugrulin. Oh, my brigade green door, Lake Vita, what box back. It's an office in your SPP. Brigadier Gininda. Lake Vita Boxback Mistrate Court. Brigadier Gininda had informed me that when I arrived at the Boxback Mistrate Court, Kitia Kitia Bogadin Tanzi came to the office in your SPP. I should then there take Bongani Tanzi to the office of the SPP. What you want to feel about? Both the gang tattoo Bongani Tanzi. Me say the office of the SPP. What does SPP stand for? SPP Imagine Senior Public Prosecutor. It stands for Senior Public Prosecutor. 
Yes. And then you know, the senior public prosecutor Otam Puncha magistrate to attend to Shanga confession. Then the senior public prosecutor was going to show us or take us to the magistrate who are supposed to take the confession. I'm sure we take it. SPP and I get the senior public prosecutor. If you some code, why is it that I get? I see, obviously. Lega manchi, the manchi ke yoko ko yone fani le icha chige. Ipa le fancy ugu vuma ita isono kuga bwantas. Awa kome hrele rafika. Wana kwa boxback court. We did indeed come arrive at the boxback. I must say, cross a safe track. I must say, court is a boxback. Rafika was PP officey. And then we arrived at the offices of the SPP, Safi office of the SPP. We are one of the officer magistrate. Then we are shown to the offices of the magistrates. A second to second office, the man, the man. The magistrate to our side, you are who? It was a female magistrate, a white lady. Oh, magistrate, you know, go as far as I know. Okay, then I'm sorry. Okay, 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 okay. A woman I got to know as Kronian. I feel I am Mazu Uti Ukronian. Over Vichakwa, a Dileka TV show magistrate to Kenna Sergeant Mohani. On arrival, I introduced myself to the magistrate as Sergeant Mohani. Also, his figure Lapo answers, he is a two long man who might do to know Sergeant Mohani. Omegitli Musariwa for confession, Ryan. And that I had brought. The suspect to her for a confession. I'm sure to Ngangi they take a long so again. I'm going to ask of you, Mister. No, I'm going to let Anya. I'm going to let Anya get a a appointment certificate. So I'm going to look at the local law office. We show the last police. And then he asked me for my appointment letter, my 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 police appointment letter. I said, "Kali, I'm not the only one. You can't show us for the same." Oh, maybe because the police in Metropolis will listen to Jonathan Rappe. We don't know why they want to bring up the name of our guard officer. And since I was being in the accompaniment of Constable Jonathan, of course, Mr. Lissari, who had accompanied me into the office, we were in Kenya. So, oh, sorry. I'm not sure if the witness is reading from the statement. Oh, it's just giving oral. His statement. His statement. So, what is in this? Who are you? Well, I didn't know the statement. Uh, are you reading from your statement? Not, not every time. Oh. What does the notes? Is it the statement or your notes? The statement. Hello. The statement. Is it signed, sir? Yes. It's By whom? By me. By you? Yes. All right. Yes, Mr. Do, do you need to refer to a statement or can you testify without referring to the statement? I need to refer. Yes. I think I would check the statement. Yes, Mr. Gonzalez. Anything you want to say? No, man. The statement uh, before it was read, there were no basis that we laid on. Yeah, but in this court, witnesses normally refresh their memories through reading statements. Are you, you are aware of that, of course. I'm aware, my lord. Yeah. But, yes. but if you want to object, you can object. Yes. yes. No yeah. problem. Okay. But <coughs> did you make the statement regarding this matter? Uh, we don't want to say it went to my lady today. That is correct. You have one channel. Was the statement reduced to writing? Uh, statement to the city, yes, I'm one of us. The statement is up on the pants. That is correct. You have one channel. Did you make the statement in your own handwriting or did someone take down your statement? Uh, we learn one last statement to say that it's all our kappa. We don't know how long our one last one. No, this is this type of key. You cannot get in. It was type of cannot get in. This type of cannot get in. But I think it's only just a little too sour and hard. I had written it in in my in my with my hand, and which was not quite legible. 
Was it a complete statement that you wrote down in your own handwriting or did you just make notes? Uh, I the lady notes. I agree. The lady notes. I had made some notes. Yes. I'm a note. Now, after Brigadier Gininda typed the statement, was it given to you? Or in which language was the statement typed? Uh, statement is the type of the That's how. In English. Typing is in English. Were you dictating the statement to him or you were telling him the statement in a certain language and he then in translated it to another language? We were using both English and the Sotho, but he was writing it down in English. So After the statement was completed, was it given to you to read? Or uh, was it read back to you? I read it myself. Were you satisfied with the contents thereof? Yes, because I was the one who was telling him. Did you then append your signature to the statement? That is correct. Just want to show you a document. Uh, is that your statement? Which one? statement is that my statement is that the one you are reading from yes. 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 yes it is what is the date on the statement Uh, the 25 October 2023. 25 October 2023. Now, okay, 2140. The time is 2140. It's got to go 2140. And was the statement commissioned? Uh, statement is still a commissioning. Hey. That is correct. Yes, by who? Sir so Commissioner of Isla Brigadier Gininda. The Brigadier Gininda. It was Brigadier Gininda. look at page one of the statement at the bottom there are some initials whose initials are those the initial chairman sherry link away pichaka they are mine our mama initials and the other initials it's a brigadier kenenda and the mama initials are brigadier kenenda the other initials are brigadier kenendas in the second page it is still mine as well. So yes. you know, um, it's just identify those yeah, okay. signature. It is my the signature and the initials of um, Brigadier Kininda as well. Yes. Then come my fellow signature. I commission one. Uh, at the end, it is my signature and also the one who commissions the, the statement. Now, do you want to refresh your memory from the statement? Yeah, before you do that, for the purposes of this court, was that statement circulated to all the councils? Yes, indeed, my lord, it was. You're not taking them by ambush or surprise. They no. are aware of. The yes, fact that, that that witness, Mohalim, made a statement. Yes, it, it was given. And to it was, us. as you say, handed over to all the people. Yes. Yes. Hello, may I just indicate that the typed statement was the one that was circulated to the councils, but the original, the handwritten. The original is written. The handwritten was never 
Secretary. Is there a handwritten statement, Mr. Badoy? Uh, we only have the type statement. Have you seen the handwritten statement? No, we haven't seen it. Now, why do you say there's one? The witness indicated, my lord, that the handwritten was not that legible. Yeah. Then it had to be, t to be we want to see that original, <laughs> the one that is not legible. Sir, where's your illegible handwritten statement? Statement, Sarah, says Sister Bonagali, and Rabu Tisiga. No, Sarah, she's straight after me, which is it. Of course, one or I we shredded it afterwards because we realized that it is too illegible to be of any use. It is shredded. But the point is, what you related to this court, it's what you perceived, experienced and did. Or oh, is there somebody else, I don't know where, who's telling you? What to testify on? When I'm not sure which I'm going to do, feel like I'm going to do it. When I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. This is what uh, happened to me. The Nida never told you what to say. The Nida how would you want to testify? Kapawaro, oh, unche upa gibo ufi. Ah, was a lot of No, he didn't do that. Yeah, okay, Mr. The Nida has a lot of people who are going to be a lot of people who are going to be a lot of people. And just clarify, the document that you say was shredded, was it a statement or notes? Eh, uh, the document that you need to say, you need to know to copy the statement. It was a note, notes in the form of statement, but not completed. It was notes in the form of a statement, but, but not completed. Effect, yeah. Yes. What was my note? I got a bad day where I figured I'm going to tell you. Yes, Mr. Valoy, yes. Was, was it indicated in the list of witnesses that this witness is going to give evidence? Um, yes, I think we did mention that is witness number 107. Number 107? Yes. So it is not arised in the yes. list of witnesses? Yes, ma'am. It's not like uh, he's flown from heaven? Yes. No, yes. no why not? Try to give yes, Mr. evidence. Yes, Mr. Want to say something? My Lord, before we proceed on the... <coughs> on the evidence that is already laid. My Lord, it will be submitted that the statement is has been irregularly, irregularly made in the sense that <coughs> the investigating officer or the head of the investigation is the one who, who was dictated with the, with the contents of the statement and it has been commissioned by the same <coughs> the head of uh, Head of investigation. No, not what this witness says. He says he apprised Ginanda of what he did all along. He was never told by Ginanda, say this, say that, say this, say you went to Puking and you got into the room there and you found uh, some uh, hoodies of different colors, but the one of the relevant color was not there. And then we took him back to Puking and then at the police station, we said, we don't know the persons in Puking. Can you give us some accompaniment? He says that's out of his own knowledge. My Lord, that's what he says. I will submit with your respect that that statement is irregular. On the basis that firstly, why, why, if disclosure was made before the mm. commencement of the trial, this statement is recently made, 25 October, 2023. It, it consists of fa fabrication because fabrication. If the, that's correct, my Lord, that's how I submit. Okay. Because that cannot be confirmed with the statement to see if it's consistent with the handwriting or the original document. Now it is the evidence of the witness to say it has been destroyed. How do we then draw a conclusion that this has not been fabricated after other Who witnesses. fabricated it? You keep saying uh, fabricated. Who fabricated it? My Lord, Because I, this witness says, this is my statement. Now, the, who, who fabricated it? The manner in which it was taken. I mean, Brigadier Geninda is the head of the investigation. And so? There's evidence that has already been led by other witnesses. 
At the same time, on the 25th of October 2023, during the course of trial within the trial, a statement is discovered to the defense without even making a cross-reference to the original statement because when he made the statement, the original statement, the authenticity of the statement shall be drawn from the original information that the witness has. He's an independent witness who testified and give, I mean, who made a statement originally giving all the circumstances of what transpired during the investigation. Now comes Brigadier Kenita, who is the head of the investigation. Now what, what, what strikes the defense more is, is the fact that if this statement was not made or typed, because I believe they have facilities to do that, if it was not typed by Brigadier Kenita himself, there is prospects that they were fabricating uh, issues. Please. As a uh, you know, let, let me just quote the law because, you know what, I'm even aware that uh, an investigating officer can take a confession, although it is advisable that he shouldn't be. You know that uh, legal principle. Yes. An investigating officer involved in the same case and investigating it. He cannot take confessions. He can. Cannot, my lord. I, I, I'm not a confession, sorry. Uh, they yes. can take a statement. Can they take a statement? That's it. Sorry, not a confession. Yes. So, that statement is, is not the same status with with that. Then the okay, let's hear Mr. Baloy. Well, it will make my <laughs> learned friends task easier. Um, just try put away the statement <laughs> and just give your evidence without the, the, the statement. They can in cross-examination take it further with you yes you arrived at the uh, boxback magistrate court and uh. you, you mentioned that you were referred to Ms. Cronier's office by the senior prosecutor what happened further uh, I just will let you the copy just in Jarena, who the copy Jari upon your certificate. Uh, like I said, he took, she took the copies of our appointment certificates. I mean, the like in Java Bessin Shilog, what at a when's a copy of my appointment certificate? A two. Home a chat and officing Yarare, IG, I chat and officing Yarare. She took them and went into her office, one tata. Inside the offices of the magistrate, there was Advocate Mujiako, who was uh, the legal representative of Mr. Ntanzi. You, when you were referring to exhibit rr the charge sheet of cocaine you mentioned you, you read out the report where the name of mjiak was also mentioned is it a different person okay. in exhibit rr no it's still the same person oh yeah so yeah no Oh, on the 24th of uh, June 2020, had you seen him before or were you seeing him for the first time? I was on my way to June. I was at home on my way to I know, I first saw him in Pukin. I was at home on my way The point is, did you see him on the 24th of June at Boxberg? Yes, I came on. Yes, I did see him. Yeah, I came on. With your own eyes. Uh, yes, you are standing next to me, in, very close to me in the office. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to make this a warm office. Yes. Uh, then we, uh, we went out of the office and uh, uh, the magistrate closed the door. I said, I'm going to make this a warm office. I'm going to make this a warm office. I'm going to make this a warm office. I'm going to make this and then Danzi was left inside the office the magistrate. together with the magistrate <laughs> and a certain woman who was an interpreter 
and also Michiaku. Advocate Michiaku. Advocate Michiaku. That is Advocate Michiaku. And we waited outside until the magistrate was finished with Ndanzi. So I'm only going to pass the Uvuye la la po magistrate eh kweta Ndanzi. If you say we waited outside, that is you and who? Eh ora we nali man. Nali nali officer Jonathan nali Yul. And just me, officer Jonathan and Yul. What I mean, officer Jonathan and Yul. Yes. Um, Baba, we ba never tamal never EMPD never no maga mo ni mo di pase ching lo kwa parking. And the others who were from the EMPD were just are standing around in passages and also in the parking. Da ba ni eke ba se EMPD ba me le mas pase ching na na le ngapan de the parking. When the time come, when the time came, when the magistrate was finished, she opened the door. Mete, we said that the magistrate was a vulmiya. Aro fedije the commission dance. And she said she was finished, and we can we could take him dance. We said to go to the one dance. So I'm tired. Yes. Uh, we took him and went to the into the cars. So some taught us in any motor any. Yes. We then took him to a police station. I don't remember which police station it is. So some taught us in this area police station. So come back to where we are police station. You mentioned that Ms. Cronier requested copies of your appointment certificate. Just want to show you an annex chart to exhibit JJ, annex chart A. Orle Cronier, you buy any kind of appointment letter, Charlie? No. The thing I go to buy is a exhibition card with JJ. Can you just identify that? We are looking here. We are not allowed for it. It is my appointment certificate. What your appointment certificate? I'm. In all this, no person can be long ago the emblem of police. It is my face and the police emblem. In the no busa ba mi no paulus police. And then kamo marawa e wana ka le arikung wana le kamo sighting di. Uh, at the back, it was not very legible. She then asked me to write my names, my full names, and, and other ID number, the ID and number, first number the rank. and the first number in the rank. I said to her, I'm going to ask you 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 to ask in which way you will click this setting? Ki ona li fatla osaga kali page ya Metropolis. It is you will click this setting with the face and the the emblem. Yeah, in which way kamu kali ID number chara kali di first number. It is also everything is written there with the ID numbers and the first numbers. Yes, the next page. Koi jela jela. In which way Wendell Logan Jonathan. Liana ini cijas fakta usaha kapeli Metropolis per cili ID number le first number. It's also written Wendell Jonathan with the ID number and the first number, etc. And who are they? Kebo mangwa cuma. Ki Metropolis. E korole ni metri member cie korole Metropolis. It is the members of the Metro of the Eguruleni Metro Police. I'm not going to expose the Metro of the Eguruleni. Yes, thank you. If you can get back to Exhibit SS. I don't know if you can go to Exhibit SS. Entry from Kutura Mot. Just show it to the witness, please. If you want to move on, what did you do? Kutura Mot, Pretoria Mot. Uh, 
Um, just read the entry on the 24th of June 2022. 1857. Number 1857. Seven, yes. Uh, in which we have a Wednesday, the 24th, June 2020. It is also written the Wednesday to 24th of June 2020 on top. The uh, serial number 1857. The serial number is 1857. Now, 1910. The time is 1910. In which we are investigation back. It is written investigation back. Sergeant Mokhalo back with one male Bongani Ntazi. Yeah, come to Sergeant Mokhalo back with one male Bongani Ntazi. It's a PS 141080 of Stroke 6, Stroke 2020. And what's the number of the number? It's SAP 14108, Stroke 06, Stroke 2020. Uh, SAP 141806 of 2020. Without any visible injuries, back correctly. That's why Naga. Enga de Malanga footige ele ebu isoe gashe. What pin do I sign? And he signed again as well. Then what happened further after the 24th of June? Uh, how about the Rahalanga Mrawal the 24th of June? Uh, really, uh, we were able to get a case of Pukeng. We then accompanied him to attend the Pukeng case. So, the same person who got here, ah, ah, be ayo, eh, vela, eh, kale, ni la se Pukeng. Yes. Yeah, I'm very interested in my channel. The late Sergeant Mabena. And then we took him there with late Sergeant Mabena. So Simeon Bisalapa, and Omo Fu Sergeant Papen. Bisalapa, sorry. Yes, is that on the date of appearances that you've just put on record from Exhibit R R? Uh, we are going to exhibit R R. Yeah, they are contained in this uh, paper here. Yes, anything further that we want to say regarding accuse number two? Uh, no, there is nothing else I want to add. Are you going to continue in this And as, did you have? Any interaction with the uh, accused number one? Eh, we ne wa banin tui diangli mula tu fato o matoma. Egan net. It is correct. Because this month we going to move on to exhibits that involve accused number one, as it's um, rather late in the day. Can we perhaps adjourn at this stage until tomorrow? What's the time now? 12 minutes past three. Mr. Uh, what's your view? Same view. I've uh, got no objection. But you don't have a view. <laughs> yes, Mr. Mubala. Thank you, my lord. I have no objection. Thank you. Yes, Mr. Mubala. No objection, my lord. Okay, are you available tomorrow? Sergeant Lutabala, I'm not sure, sir. I will be available, my lord. Where do you stay? In a hotel? Uduna, guy. Uduna, what's your name? No, we're not over in Tonya. I send my child to get my own home. They refused an offer of the Sheraton, yeah? We're not going to go to the Sheraton. Okay, until tomorrow then. Understand?